Hello everyone, this is Cody Lee of BlackCatBooks.org, author of Eye of the Dragon, Cool and Beautiful, Rabbit Hole, King Dio, and the upcoming Lauren Frey, releasing in 24 hours, and actually less than 24 hours, so please go ahead and pre-order that now. Sorry for being late, guys. Uh, I I was just exhausted. I, I got up on time. I was just doing things casually. I watched like a bunch of movies, some anime, uh, Kiki, GoldenEye, all, all sorts of stuff. <laughs> and, like, and like I ended up just passing out again uh, for a couple of hours. I um I had I had something to do in the morning, so it's a good thing I took a nap. But uh, man, am I exhausted? Like at the end of my work week, it is, it is um it is ridiculous. Um, it's it's gotten to the point where I won't even play games. Honestly, I um uh, I worked on the book a little bit though. I, I did some work on Eye of the Dragon, and uh, I started a bestiary for my uh, for my books too, which I probably won't publish at least not right away. Um, <laughs> uh, it might be a posthumous thing. I don't know. We'll see. I don't know. I've been thinking. I don't. I won't want my uh, my universe to continue after my death. I don't know. Well, we'll see. Um, we'll see how this goes. I, I haven't. I have no idea what the how realistically um, this is going to go. But anyway. Yeah, I started uh, work on a bestiary because uh, I had so many like deep lore things about like uh, individual uh, races and like monsters in uh, in my uh, the Cody verse. I, I, we're calling it at the moment. Um, it's it's going to be a while before I reveal the, the official name. There has been an official name since the beginning, but uh, let, let's wait a little bit longer before revealing it. Um, yeah, so I did some like uh, the first the first monster uh, the first person that Jack fights in Mouth of the Dragon is a Medusa. So I was coming up with like all this lore in regards to, like the Medusa and like how their society is structured. You know, they're an all female race. Uh, they they are they are primarily Olympians because of their origins. Um, they hate Athe they hate Athena for obvious reasons. Um, hang on, where are we going? Like, things like that. And then, like, I kind of introduce, like, uh, kind of the weird stuff that I'm doing. Uh, in this case, um, when it comes about the dragon, uh, I came up with, like, a, a warrior Medusa, uh, Bella Stone. Uh, someone who has mastery over um, several martial arts. Both of which uh, utilize her powers in ways I really don't think have been done before in fiction. Uh, I might actually release some statements about this uh, when it comes to the pre-release uh, hype cycle for for Eye of the Drag uh, for Mouth of the Dragon. Yeah, but am I going insane? By the way, because uh, I thought Majora's Mask was coming out this weekend. Like, and I wake up and like Earthbound is out. Majora's Mask is it? Like, I, I don't know. I swear I saw somewhere that it was, uh, Majora's Mask was confirmed to come out, uh, February 10th. And then, like, I wake up to go download it, and it's not there yet. It doesn't make any sense. I, I swear, I... It was, uh, it was weird. Very, very strange. Okay, let's, let's get the jiggies first. We can get, we can get, like, uh, the notes later. How many jiggies do we have here? Let's see. Five? Four, okay. Yeah, Rusty Bucket Bay is probably a bad level to stop playing on because because I don't remember exactly what I did. Uh, like, typically what I do is I always go around first and then go to the ship and, like, get everything in there, but I think I might have, uh... Let's see. Yeah, we definitely didn't get all the jinjos. Yeah, I am a, I'm not a, I don't think I like the the last half of the game as much as the the first uh, the, the first uh, first two thirds. I don't know. I just don't like Rusty Bucket Bay. I don't like uh, Bad Monster Mansion, and I don't like uh, I don't think I like Click Clock Woods that much. Um, that much I would say. There are things I like about Click Clock Woods. I think it's probably the best level out of the, out, of the, out of the three. But I don't know. Like these levels become more tedious than fun, in my opinion. And it's not like it's not like they don't have like merit or something, but like. I think this is the point where the game's flaws kind of kind of shine through. Oh, here we go. 
like going everywhere to collect things is really annoying in this area in particular. Um, there's a reason I think I kind of I could kind of take a break from it when I got here. I think I think that typically happens is that like I get through like a good chunk of the game. And then I get to Rusty Bucket Bay, take a break, and then I kind of just slowly, incrementally, just go through it. Like, every single time. Here we go. Let's, let's Okay, I think we can just go down there. Yeah, I really wanted to play Madrid's Mask tonight. I really did. And uh, I'm really kind of disappointed it's not there. We might do Earthbound. I don't know. I, I really, really wanted to get through Dragon Quest before doing Earthbound. I, I think we might hold off on Earthbound a bit. I'm sure everyone is streaming it at the moment, so I think I'm going to... I think I'm gonna hold off on that one. I, I really want to finish Dragon Quest. I do. I, I, I'm playing so much stuff right now. I don't want to like start another game. Like I want to get through like Dragon Quest five and six. I want to get through like uh, did I beat eleven? Oh, I did beat eleven, didn't I? Oh wow. It's weird to think that I actually beat eleven. I kind of forgot that I did because um, it took me so long to do. But I, I finally did go back and do it. But I gotta get, I gotta beat five and six, and then like Final Fantasy nine and then five. I, uh, I probably should focus on those first. I have like three on Steam, which I should probably play. Um, yeah, there's there's a lot of stuff to do. And then like we have Chrono Cross coming out in like the next couple months, which I think is gonna be a day one purchase for me. I think. Uh, I am very excited for that. A little live. Uh, very excited for that. I've been I've been told by uh, people. Uh, whose opinions I value very highly, that Live a Live is is great. Uh, one of the best games Square Soft that never left Japan. So uh, I, it's been on my list for a long time. I was uh, I was considering learning Japanese to get it, to play it, but I'm glad it's uh, I'm glad it's getting an official release. Um, I don't know. That's the thing, isn't it? Like a lot of classic Square Soft games are finally getting re-released again. Like um, you know, uh, Secret of Mana three. Mana 3 got re-released. After years of... Uh, here we go. What the fuck? After years of people trying to tell me that like it was never, ever going to happen. I know, back in the day, people used to... Oh, fuck. Back in the day, people used to like justify piracy because of games like that. And now, like, they're getting official releases. So, um, yeah, it feels like... It really does feel like the, the days of the pirate are, are coming, to a, uh, coming to an end. It's Pirates of the Caribbean 3. <laughs> Where, like, Jack Sparrow and all those guys try to keep their degenerate criminal lifestyles going. I don't understand that movie at all. Like, they're glamorizing the life of a pirate? Like, really? Like, is it really a bad thing that, like, uh, pirates are getting eliminated from the high seas? Like, it's not. But, it, like, it, the movie treats it like it's one of the worst things in the world. Never, never understood that. Um, I, uh, I've got to watch those movies. Maybe not. Uh, I don't know. I've I've um going through James Bond again. I got to like the Brosnan one and actually and actually stopped. Uh, I I'm at the point now where I think it's like our moral duty to not simply not watch movies, like regardless of how good they are, because like they're always gonna have some kind of weird propaganda to them. Like in Bond's case, it kind of promotes this idea that like women can be leaders and <laughs> and like effective agents, which isn't fucking true obviously like uh i hate that shit um like the best thing to do is just not watch it like it, it really it it really is review tech usa says he's getting rid of a switch for a steam deck he's just clickbaiting he, he's not actually gonna do that the fucker he has an ol he has an oled what why would he yeah he, he's just clickbaiting uh I people like Review Tech. They're they're the people who have tricked the Steam, uh, the PC gaming community into thinking that like Valve actually has a shot at replacing <laughs> at replacing the Switch. It's uh, it's ridiculous. We might actually get a game over. Wow. 
No wonder I don't like Rusty Lucky Bay that much if I struggle this much with it. Um, okay, let's go back, slow it down. Yeah, let's get the jiggy here. <gasps> First of all, I, yeah, let's get all the jiggies and then just probably just come back for the notes or something. Yeah. Yeah. But yeah, I don't, I don't, I don't even trust. Like, I, I don't trust Ryu Techno Sin. Um, like, how can you if you like know anything about his history, his background, his legacy? Like, I remember back in 2013 when he was telling people that like. The PS4 was going to going to have problems at launch. It would be like literally unplayable uh, online due to like some resolution issues or, or some shit. Like, um, no, that's not. It wasn't true. I, uh, I I I hoped it was true because I, I wanted PlayStation to get fucked even then. But like, it turned out not to happen. And like, uh, he, he just laughed it off, and his audience just moved on to the next like baby stuff. Fuck Review Tech USA. Fuck him. Like, he is the worst. And, and, like, he's a really good example of why uh, uh, YouTube is not a, it's not a career, I, I think. Because of just how he's de degenerated over the past uh, decade. Like, he, he's not looking healthy. He's not looking well. Um, his, his, uh, his coverage is, like, iffy at best. Like, why, why would you ever listen to this guy? Like, and, like, I, I don't know who his audience is. Like, his, his views have remained pretty static over the past, like, uh, decade. Like, I, I I really feel this way. Um, here we go. I, I've seen him. Like, I've been, watch I, I've been watching, like, his view count more closely than I think any other YouTuber I've ever seen. And, like, it's always statically, like, uh, 40 to 100,000 views. There are, like, clickbaity videos that get more than that. And then, like, some niche topics that get less. But for the most part, that, that it's generally around that, like around that, like, uh, margin, 40 to 80,000 views. Like, his audience isn't growing. Who, who's watching him? Oh, hang on, we can go back to this. Oh, come on! What? Are we not gonna get a single jiggy? That is, uh, that is some embarrassing shit. Yeah, we'll probably just keep playing this until, like, we, uh, we get through Rusty Bucket Bay. Because uh, I don't want to give up. I want to, I want to stay on it. I mean, we could theoretically, there are, like, three, two jiggies to get in this area alone, right? We have this, we have the, uh, and we have the Wonderful Water. So we'll just circle back around and get the Underwater one. Uh, and then from there, we'll move on to the next one. Yeah, I, I don't like Rusty Bucket Bay. It's, uh, it's tedious to play. Especially since, like, on repeat playthroughs, because, uh... Because, like, you forget where all the notes are. You, what, what, like, you have to collect the notes are all over and over and over again. And, like... There are lots of rooms here where there are no notes, so like you're wasting your time going to it to get them. It is, it is extremely annoying. I, I really dislike it. I don't know. I think I think like, it, it, it's such a shame because this level does have like some really cool ideas that I really like. Like compared to Prime Master Mansion, I think it has like better highs because I, I I do like the. Uh, I do like a lot of the, the jiggies themselves, but it's just, it's just like getting to them, get, like all the steps taken. It's like uh, you have to take, like just the, like it's just ridiculous. I, I I can totally see why this is a lot of people's least favorite level. I don't I don't agree with it necessarily, but um, I mean the reason I like it, like it has really good platforming, like the best in the game. Like look at this, isn't isn't this awesome? Like this is pretty pretty difficult. But we have to, like, hit the switch when we come back down here. We have to, like... Okay. Oops. That didn't work. Alright, we got it. Alright, jiggy number five. 
Yeah, huh? Is the bitch witch over here? Oh. What does that side do? Oh, do you have to hit both of them? Hang on. I don't know, I don't remember this side very well. So you have to hit both of them before you can get the... Ah, okay, shit. And then the timer starts going down, and then you have to escape, and you have to get out there. It's uh, kind of a pain, honestly. Shit, man. Yeah, it's like they made this one, like, as annoying as possible. Like, you have to, like, stop and check to make sure it's not gonna twirl on you when you're going across. Okay. After this, it's smooth sailing, but, like, like they really tacked on a lot of unnecessary, unnecessary nonsense to this, this jiggy, I think. And it's one of my favorites, too, which is, uh, kind of a shame. Uh, again... Like, the entire game is kind of rough around the edges. It's one of the reasons I think I would recommend the Xbox version over it. I'm not saying this version is bad. Oh, fuck. What side is it? Fuck. Uh, yes, I'm 100% sure. This side, hopefully. I swear, if it's not... If it is, okay. Does it matter what side you go into? Okay. Oh, you gotta be kidding me. I got the Jiggy, but I died anyway? Ah, ridiculous. Talk about a Catch-22. Oh, not a Catch-22. Talk about a... Uh, what the fuck kind of... What, what the fuck expression am I looking for? Um... Yeah, I, uh, I just saw that, that I have Catch-22 in my, my wish list. Actually, do I have it on here? I might actually have it on my shelf already. I've been wanting to read Catch-22 forever, but I, I've never gotten around to it. Um, I have, like, some Mark Twain novels picked out. I just picked, I just bought, like, four copies of uh, uh, Dragon Riders of Kern. I bought, like, The Black Company Chronicles. Um, I bought... Um, I think I think my... Uh, I think the next volume of Call the Night is available. I think. Because um, I got... I got charged for it. So I think uh, I'm about ready for some more vampire... Uh, vampire Is that Conquer? Wait, what the fuck is this? What the fuck is this? Uh, okay, what, whatever. There's something in here that's good. What the fuck? Oh, come on. Ridiculous. Ridiculous. And you know, I've been listening to the, uh, I've been listening to Harry Potter, uh, book six on Audible. That has been a trip, uh, let me tell you, because, uh, book six, uh, that's the one I, um, I, I never disliked it. It was the one I thought was, uh, the weaker entry in the series. Like, when people told me that, like, six is their least favorite book, I, I kind of understood why, because not a lot happens. Um, uh, oops. Damn it. Did I get a fucking game over? Oh. Damn it, ridiculous. Unbelievable. We're gonna have to start over because <sighs> Rusty Bucket Bay is just too hardcore for uh, for casual Nintendo exclusive Cody Lee. Can't even beat Banjo. Let alone we we real games like uh, Resident Evil 8 or uh, <laughs> Horizon Zero Dawn. <laughs> Yeah, so I was listening to Harry Potter 6 on Audible, and I have to say, I have to say, um, I am enjoying it a lot more than I used to. It, it, I think it's the only, only book in the series that I think I've liked more this, uh, this time, uh, this go-around. And I think it's because it's so, uh, 
it's so mature with like its relationship drama and stuff like that. I, uh, well, not the, not the relationship drama, like the political stuff and just uh, the the feeling of dread for Voldemort. I, I think as a kid I didn't appreciate it too much, but now I I'm really into it. Um, you know, it, this is right before shit goes down in, in book seven. So, um, yeah, seeing how, like, terrified everyone is, and then seeing, getting a good payoff in book seven is a big deal. Like, the ministry is going crazy, like, um, you know, everyone's, like, frazzled as fuck, um, you know, Dumbledore is gonna fucking die, like, it's, um, it is really good. Uh, some, some iffy spots aside. I, I can't believe I just praised the romance, because, uh, the romance is, like, by far the worst part of it. Like, I, uh, Hermione's such a bitch in this. This is, just, like... I, I don't like Hermione in general. I mean, not, not as much as most people, actually. Um, I mean, I, I, liked, I like her just fine, but, like, most people think she's the best thing ever, and I don't agree with that. Um, uh, book six is, like, Hermione uh, very close to her absolute worst, like, in the regards. Just her being just extremely passive-aggressive and just being, like, a complete, a complete bitch to everyone, especially Ron. Like, she gets jealous that Ron is having sex, so she just... Herod is getting laid, so she just asks out, goes out with people he doesn't like, and just bitches at him constantly. It's, uh, even though they clearly want to fuck, it's like, Harry's just like, bro, just, just get it over with already. Like, ugh. It's, uh, I don't know, it's funny in some instances, but, like, um, usually it's, like, kind of cringy. Kind of. Uh, I don't, I, I don't know, they're, they're young, so I guess this kind of thing is normal, but... Uh, I, I never really had that experience, honestly. Like, everyone I I was with at that age uh, were great. Uh, I was the problem in that relationship, but I think, like, uh, I think they would tell you it was because of, like, my my home situation. I think. Um, you know, being poor as fuck and stuff like that. Uh, you know, abused by my parents. I, I don't know. I don't know. I'm on I'm good terms with all my exes, so. Um, well, almost all of them. Oh, no, no, I'd say all of them, yeah. Yeah, she, uh, she's really... The problem child has really, uh... Seems to have really matured, I think, maybe. I don't know, I, I think I have more problems with her than she has with me. Uh, anyway, whatever. Um, the problem child, oh, whatever. Um, <laughs> um... But yeah, like, this, this go-around, I've really... I really started liking Ginny a lot more. Like, I think, I think in the past, back when, like, I first read this, I kind of bought into, like, the, the hype that, like, Ginny wasn't a good match for Harry. That, like, he should have been with, like, Hermione or something. Like, I, I thought that, like, uh, people had good points when, when it comes to, came to that. But, like, reading it again, no, no. Ginny is, like, perfect for him. She really is. Like, they actually have a lot in common. They like being around each other. Like, um... Uh, they care about each other a lot, even before they get together. Like it's uh it's actually pretty pretty based, honestly. So yeah, Ginny got like shit. Sh Ginny won like Harry Potter. Like shit, like out of all the girls he interacted with at Hogwarts, it was fuck Ginny fucking Weasley, who like married him. <laughs> like shit. Yeah, yeah, I used to make fun of her for, like, having red hair when, like, Harry's mother had red hair. Like, oh, man, Harry has an Oedipus complex. But no, like, it, she's, like, she's really feisty. Here we go. Like, I can definitely see, like, the appeal of her. I mean, I, I wouldn't go for her. I don't like redheads, honestly. Never been with one. I uh, don't really care to. I don't, I don't know, maybe. I, I'm not around a lot of them. I have, uh, I, I've talked about this on Twitter before. I'm, I'm getting sick of, like, being around blonde women in particular. <laughs> like, I don't... It's not that I don't like them. I, I've been, like, jokingly saying I don't like them, but... Uh, I... It's not that I don't like them. It's just that, like, I, I watch it for girls with, like, black hair. And, like, I... I don't see a lot of them. I don't. Like, I, I don't know where the fuck it, where the fuck they are. Like, it's just... It, it's, it's disheartening. Here we go. Oops. You know, it must be like my area or something. Like everyone is fucking blonde. 
Like everyone, I just. I think I bitched about this on Twitter. Like, uh, I, I just been in a restaurant and like every every woman there was like blonde and I was just like in spite of like being a wide range of generations and like backgrounds, all, all of them are blonde, and I was just like, this, this fucking sucks. <laughs> like it does. And living in like a dystopian hell. Like where where are the black haired girls? Shit. I mean, they already did that with the wonderful 101, right? So, uh, you get the wonderful 101. <laughs> I don't know. I don't know. It, it's been a while since I played. I, uh... <sighs> People really don't want to admit that Nintendo won the console war. They really don't. They're, like, dragging this out for as long as they possibly can. Uh... Do you know how many, like, comments I've gotten over the past month on, like, my uh, my Steam Deck videos? Because, like, Steam Deck fans legit think it's going to replace the Switch in some some capacity at the moment. Like, I think, like, when it, uh, when it actually comes out, it'll... I don't know why you keep thinking... I keep thinking you can hit them, but... Um... Let's go around again. Hang on, let's go this way. Yeah, like, uh, the Steam Deck's coming out in 15 days, and these guys are coming on my comment section. Like, Valve is releasing... The Steam Deck is coming out in 10 days, right? 15 days. And they're releasing Portal on Switch. Like, they announced a release of Portal on Switch. Like, doesn't that, like, just scream that Valve itself has no confidence in the, in the Steam Deck's success? And, like, nobody's really talking about it at all. Like, nobody, nobody's addressing it. Nobody, nobody is, like, really talking about it at all. Meanwhile, you have, like, people constantly speculating that, like, oh, man, is, is Nintendo going multi-plot? No, they're not. Um, they never will at this, at this stage. But people pretend they are with, like, due to emulators and stuff like that. It, it's, it's weird. Yeah, I'm, I'm not, I'm not super happy with the, uh, the PC gaming crowd at the moment. Well, that's right, we need the Jinjos, don't we? Yeah, so there's two more to go, and then, like, Jinjo hunting. There's one in the, the water here, right? I've always hated that one. Like, why is it surrounded by sharks? Just leave. Okay, um... Oh, there's two right next to each other, okay. Should I, should I collect it? Uh, there's no point. I don't think I'm gonna... Yeah, we might as well. I mean, we're gonna die for sure. There's so much... There's so much shit that can kill you here. Oh, yeah, another thing. I was, uh... I was playing, uh, Donkey Kong Country Returns, uh, when I got out this morning, uh, for a couple of hours. I went to, like, World 7, and, like, uh, yeah, yeah, all of World 7. And, like, uh, I really, really like the first seven, uh, six worlds of Returns. I think they're great stuff. Uh, and originally I was thinking that, like, maybe it's better than Tropical Freeze, but, like, later on, like, the, the game does lose a lot of steam. Uh, it, it's really weird. Like, uh, the factory level, the factory world is just really, really bad. Like, a lot like the original, actually, uh, where it's just, it just gets really boring and, like, repetitive and the, the gimmicks aren't interesting and they're clunky. The boss is, like, the lamest thing I've ever seen. It's a chicken and a mech. And, like, it, it's not even funny, you know what I mean? Like, a eh, chicken and a mech, yeah, that, that's, that's hilarious. But, uh, no, they, they didn't make it work at all. And, like, the boss itself is clunky. It's just, uh... I 100% agree with uh, most people when I say Returns is way... Uh, Tropical Freeze is way, way better. Um, yeah, yeah, most people will, like, debate whether one or Donkey Kong Country 1 or 2 is better, but, like, when it comes to Returns, I think I think everyone agrees uh, Tropical Freeze is better. Like, I, I feel like Retro might not have, like, nailed the platform thing right away. 
Because which is kind of weird to say, because the game is generally so high quality. But um, I don't. There are like weird things like in in the game that make me think they didn't quite understand. Like some of the gimmicks don't work. Like uh, the enemy playing skin is weird. Some of like the uh, some of the platforming is just kind of clunky. Uh, it depends. It, it's a it's a level to level thing. But for the most for the most part, it's like yeah, this game is. Um, it's an evolution of DKC, but, like, uh, there's a reason I haven't replayed it that much. I, I think, like, the game as a whole isn't really all that fun to replay. There are, like, some good highlights um, that make it worth coming back to, but, like, uh, I, I, think it's, I think it's safe to say, like, I, I think, like, uh, it's better than 3, but, like, worse than all the others. Uh, I mean, to be fair, we're talking about, like, the best, <laughs> some of the best platforming games ever made, so uh, it, it, that's really not saying much to say that, like, uh, to say it's like the fourth best game in the series, but I um I don't know, it really makes me miss like rarewares stamp on the on the hardware like they really they really sold you on like the donkey kong country world i think i think returns like um at least like the original returns like didn't quite have like the same feeling of personality like it looks pretty generic actually with like the animals and like the the, the D tech tribe like it's not it's not super it's not it doesn't pull you in the same way as dkc one or two does like, it, it feels a lot like DKC3 with just the random animal designs and stuff like that. It's just, uh... There's an elephant in the game, and I, I keep wondering, is that, is that supposed to be Ellie? But uh, I, I, there's no confirmation on it. That'd be hilarious if, like, Ellie just showed up and you had to fight the shit out of Ellie. Because I, I hate Ellie. Like, I have such a weird, like, I, I don't like DKC3 in general. But, like, Ellie the Elephant is, like, probably one of the things I always point to as being, like, the one thing that does not belong. Like, Ellie, like Ellie is, like, the absolute worst. I, I hate her. I hate her gimmicks. I hate her, like, fear of mice. I hate, like, her levels. It's, uh, the boss fight she's in is just awful. Um, but, like, Rare seemed to think she was, like, the best thing ever. Um, and that, that's just... Ugh. That's all we had to do. Wait, you just get a one-up? <sighs> Nothing good? What, what was the point of that? Yeah, that, there wasn't even any notes in here. There's nothing in here. <sighs> uh, can you, uh, can you pop into the ceiling? Do you get anything? Okay. I like? Okay. Is there a Jiggy or a Jinjo in here? I would expect a Jinjo actually, but I can't. I was, yep, hear it. I hear it. Yeah, it's, in, it's in here. Okay, yeah, so I think next time, uh, next run, we'll try to get all the Jinjos. Because if we know where three of them are, here we go. Yep, there's the Lua. Yeah, I think we know where three of them are, so it shouldn't be too hard to find the, the other two. They're probably in the tanker or somewhere. You know, how do you get out? But yeah, I don't. I don't think rare. I don't think retro really nailed like the cartoony vibe like rareware did. They, they, uh, rareware is like uh, visual design and like uh, just just gameplay. Like that appeals to kids even today. And I think like the original DKC kind of established established itself as like an all time classic of uh, of Nintendo fans. And I, I don't think Returns hit the same mark. I really don't. Uh, despite being like technically better in a lot of ways, it's uh, kind of interesting. Kind of an interesting case study, actually. Um, 
Let's go. Ah, fuck. Yeah, we have, we're going to have to go around. Um, how do you get over there? Okay, yeah, you can... Okay, yeah. Every time... I keep forgetting about that. Is there an easy way into the tanker? Uh, no, we're gonna have to go back around. We're gonna have to go back to the walkway. Just... It's annoying. That's what it comes down to. It's annoying. But, but... Yeah, we're going back anyway. We might as well get the Jinjos. We might come across the last couple while we're looking. Surprised the acid doesn't just kill you right away. I thought he was on a buoy. Where is he? Okay, you can't see him from a distance. Okay. I fucked that up. Why did the shark spawn right in front of me? Alright. Alright. Okay, we got it. Uh, I'm just gonna leave. Oh, oh fuck. Man. Where's the fence? How do I get out? Oh, there we go. Like, this pisses me off. Like, why doesn't this regenerate your health? Like, Banjo could just take it a gasp of air. Well, uh, well whatever. And I guess that goes against the gimmick of Rusty Bucket Bay, but... I think there's a health thing in here. Let's go put that up. I was like trying to remember, like, where, where can I get some more health? And I think there's one in here. Yeah, I might get six extra pieces here. Like, four extra pieces, excuse me. They can't do anything. They can't do anything to stop me. I'm Banjo. I'm Banjo Kazooie. All right. Like, does anyone know when Majora's Mask is coming out on an SO? I I swear it was supposed to be yesterday, but it hasn't updated. I, I don't know what the, what the deal is up with that. Did they delay it because uh, Earthbound was coming out today, or or what? I, I'm confused. I I swear it was the tenth. I I was legit making plans to stream it tonight, but. Oh, there's the bitch switch. Let's go with that. Uh, you kind of have to get the bitch switch right away, because, like, they're kind of... They're kind of in, uh... They're kind of in isolated areas. All right, here we go. Yeah, we'll probably just get the Jinjos, like, after we, uh, we get them all. Here we go. What the fuck? Uh... Yeah, we'll just... There we go. There's, a. <laughs> There's an extra course. Uh... No way to get around. No. Okay. Hey. Okay. So there's a there's a fourth gym. Yeah. Okay. Where's the last one? So they're all like around the area. Okay. So the ninjas aren't hard to get. Honestly, um, it, they don't seem they don't seem to be hard to get at all. We could probably get them all, but I don't remember the last one is. Is it the one? Is there one like in that last area? I think I think we might be able to get it. Okay. 
I think I might know where it is. Uh, not last area. It's like in the underwater thing. Okay. I don't remember where all the rings are, though. That's another thing. I, I don't remember where the rings are in this level at all. Uh, I mean, to be fair, we're not getting the rings. I, I don't consider that for a one percent completion. I mostly just care about notes and and, uh, and jiggies. But actually, I don't even think I get all the notes sometimes. Uh, well, we'll see. I tend to get all the notes because uh, I like having power ups at the end. Uh, holy crap! It's like one of two bosses in this game. <laughs> boss boom boxes hold. Yeah, this guy says he's a boss, but this game has no bosses. It's I don't even consider this a real boss, because look at this. Compared to Brintilda at the end, this guy's a chunk. Complete chunk. Oh, is this not working? like a boss to you, it, it doesn't to me. Good thing, this guy isn't in Smash Bros, otherwise he'd be the lamest character on the roster. Worse than Steve. Alright. Okay, what could possibly be worse than Steve? I mean, at least this guy has a legacy with Nintendo consoles. Uh, Steve does not. Here we go. Yeah, everything is releasing unfinished. Um, like, developers have to, like, pump out games in order to meet their quotas, and uh, even, like, the most dedicated of fanboys are getting sick of it. So, um, yeah, I, I don't know how much longer the game industry is going to be able to continue in this fashion. I really don't. Um, I mean, I already don't give them money, so... Um, I mean, the problem is that, like, people just will not give up their entertainment. Like, it, it's the same with, like, movie franchises. Like, people bitch about, like, horror movie, uh, horror movie sequels and, uh, and, like, Star Wars being bad, but you still go to see them, don't you? Like, I, I've been refusing to see them for a long time. Uh, I, I don't go see films. In fact, I'm, like, considering extending that to, like, not buying uh, films in certain franchises or from certain people. It's, uh... And I don't think, like, most people are doing that. Like, I'm still seeing people talking about, like, Boba Fett. Like, who the fuck cares? Like... Uh, it's weird to me. I, I can't imagine sticking with a franchise for that long if, like, you're not actually enjoying it. You know what I mean? Uh, Jinjo... Ah, shit, where's the last one? Okay. Okay, I think there's, like, one down here or some shit. Uh, yeah, yeah you, yeah, you take the anchor. Yep, it's the anchor. Yeah, but then we have the Jinjo one. He still takes an air, but he's still losing air bubbles. Oh, whatever. You know, this level isn't as bad as uh, people give it credit for. I, I enjoyed this. Um, there's no Jinjo. Oh, that shit. Yeah, hey, where's the where's the last Jinjo? We probably should. I don't know. We could probably just come back later. I, I know where I know where they all are, or four of them are. So we just have to go go around and look for them, and then we have to come back for the notes probably. It's a dolphin, isn't it? How do you need drown? What do you think, man? Yeah, I, I think we're gonna... We might actually stream, like, the N64 soon, because I, I want to play Banjo-Tooie. I, I want to beat it on console, and then we'll probably just start it from scratch on NSO when it comes out. I don't know when. It's not confirmed yet, so it's probably going to be the next couple of years. I think we should go ahead and finish Banjo-Tooie now, and then, like, do stuff like GoldenEye, like, uh... Like Majora's Mask, maybe? I don't know. 
Yeah, I have, I have my copy of Majora's Mask in the console, uh, so I could legit just stream it now. I don't have to wait for the NSO version. Let's see, all right, that's nine. Now we just have the Jinjo one. Should we go ahead and try to get it at least? Oh, Yeah, we might as well like try to beat our note record. There's the yellow one out there, right? Oh, we got that one, okay. Oh shit. Is there no way up? Shit. Is there no way up from that direction? I'd like to just skip it, but no, apparently not. How would I rate last Nintendo Direct? It was pretty good. I, uh, I enjoyed it. It's not like, not my favorite thing ever, because I don't like Xenoblade and I don't like Warriors, but... Uh, yeah, I, uh, I, I liked a lot of the, uh, a lot of the obscure shit. Like, uh, there, there were a lot of niche games I was happy about seeing. Uh, but let's put it that way. Like, the big announcements I didn't care for, but... Um, I don't know. I... I... I don't like Xenoblade. I, I really don't. Like, I have, uh... I, I, I'm considering, like, streaming Xenoblade Chronicles X tonight to see, like, um... Uh, just to stream it and, like, trying to get back into it. But I don't know. Um, I probably won't, because I really don't like the game. I've played it, like, for 50 hours, and I, I still don't enjoy it. So I think that, like, yeah, I think it's time... I think... Even though it still continues to get new games... I think I do need to, like, really pa practice restraint and stop, like, buying them. Because I just don't enjoy them. I didn't like Xenoblade Chronicles 2, and I don't like 3. I don't like the look of 3. It looks like more of the same. I don't know. It's so disappointing, because I would like an, a large open-world RPG from Nintendo, but uh, Xenoblade just isn't it, um, I, I think. I, I don't think it really holds up. Zelda was, like, way better made, I, I think. I'm, I'm, not, I'm not hyped for uh, Xenoblade Chronicles 3 at all. It's, it's weird how we're pretending that, like, X never happened at, at this point. Like, we're just making Xenoblade sequels as if, as if X just doesn't exist. It's weird. That game is, like, giant. That game is gigantic. It legit is probably one of the biggest RPGs ever made. And I, I don't see enough people talk about it. I don't know, maybe they're, like, really going to go for, like, we're going to make a planet this time. But that's what they wanted to do with the original, is that they were like, yeah, we're going to make an open world the size of a real planet, and that we couldn't manage it. And, I don't know, maybe that'll be the, the plot of the sequel? I just have, like, Mira just be, like, you know, just fully flesh out Mira. That's what I would do, is just, like, just reuse the map from X, and then just get a, put in a real story this time. Um... um Ah, shit. Okay, damn it. Oh, that's right. There's one up here anyway, so we can uh, get that. Yeah, we're going to click back one immediately after this. Oh, actually, there's, um... Oh, wait, no, I got it already. Shit, okay. So I came back here for no reason. Okay. I completely forgot. Okay, uh... Yeah, click lock wood after this. Um, when do you have? When do you unlock the ability to go to the go to the last world? Like, how many notes do you need? Like, it's. I don't remember what's keeping you from it. It's possible we might have enough notes already, because uh, I I one percent all the other worlds. So, I think I think not maybe not Mad Monster Mansion, but did, did I do that? What is my total? Yeah, Rusty Bucket. Yeah, Mad Monster Mansion I gave up on. Gobi's Valley. Where's Easy Peak? I'm missing one in for Peak. Okay. Yeah, it's the Christmas tree one. I, I didn't bother getting that for some reason. I don't know. I, going through the game again and, like, getting everything we missed is always a lot of fun, so... It's always satisfying when, like, you just count down, like, to, to the last Jiggy. 
Like when you're just going around, just like okay, what's latchkey? Like lately, it's always been the la it's always been that one in Click Clock Wood where you uh, where you get the bee and you just fly up and you find it. Like I think the past couple of times I played it, including like the first time I played it, that, that was the last one I got. So um, I don't know what it is about catching in particular, but all right. Yeah, but I think I'm gonna. I think I will uh, pop in DK64 after this. I, I, yeah, there's a lot of there's a lot of N64 games I want to stream, so I think I will like um, stream a lot of that. Um, uh, in the upcoming weeks. Um, yeah, a lot, a lot of the N64 games that are um, that are coming out on NSO I've streamed already. Like I've already done Pokemon Snap. I've already done like F Zero X. I've already done like a lot of that stuff. I'll probably do like a full playthrough of F Zero X, but. Um, I mean, to be fair, when Mario Kart 64 came out uh, on NSL, I'd actually already uh, played through all of it uh, on on hardware. Um, so, oh yeah, it was City Kong Racing. I was uh, playing a while back. I need to get back to that. I still haven't done the Fifth Circuit. I was doing like um, I was doing like time trial stuff. I was going to try to unlock TT, which I've never done, and I never actually managed to do it. Uh, oops, shit. I, I gotta get back to, uh, get, get back on the... Is there anything in here? I don't know why you would do this instead of just taking the... Uh, just taking the other rope, alright. Is that the purple one? Where's the purple one? Yeah, it has to be on the bow. It has to be. There's no way it's not. Or maybe it's like under the bow? Is, it, is that possible? Oops. I guess we can check real quick. I'm sure it's in the boat somewhere. Um, makes me nervous when you're, like, that far away from a piece of, like, I don't like how there's nowhere to, like, uh, rest on the, on the water, and, like, you have to just, all right, whatever. And so while we're getting the gingos, we'll collect the notes, too, so we'll see. Wait, could it possibly be in here? Notes did we collect our first run through? Does anyone remember? What's our best score for this? Oh, here we go. Oh no, where am I gonna get some healing? Alright, uh. Yeah, I've already put like 60 hours into uh, Nintendo 64 online. Legit 60 hours into this. This is legit one of the most played Switch games. Um, which is kind of amusing, but. I don't know, it's kind of sad too. They, they really don't make games as good as this. Well,. Here we go. Yeah, it's probably one of the windows or some shit. That took me forever to figure out back in the day was like the fact that you could break the windows. All right, here we go. Like I figured out by accident, I think. Yeah, there's nothing in here. Let's see. Yeah, this world wasn't as bad as I uh, thought it was. Yeah, okay, I'm... Yeah, the entire game, I think. I was kind of talking up the fact that, like, I expected this to be rough compared to the Xbox version, but not really. Uh, in fact, I kind of enjoy replaying the stage. Uh, yeah, I don't, I don't, I'm not sure I would say the Xbox version is better at this point. Uh, 
Like, there are, like, it's easier, but I don't think that, that might not be a good thing. Like, ugh. I guess it's debatable? I don't know, like, I don't want to call the Xbox version trash or anything, because I did enjoy playing it, but... Um... Are there any notes? We'll, we'll go down there last, I think. Because that area is the po positively the worst. I, I hate it. Like, that... <laughs> we're gonna get destroyed when we go down there, okay. Okay. Yeah, once we get the last Jiggy, we'll be done with the rest of the game. Well, to be fair, we have, like, the notes to get to, so. Yeah, I like getting all the notes, because that gives you access to all the, uh, all the powers in the end, so. I, I like that. I don't know. Like, you don't really need them, because I'm good enough at the game that I can just beat Gratilda, so I might be at the point where I can just not get all the notes. Like, I'm good enough at the game to, like, trust in my ability to beat Gratilda right away and not have to, like, restock or anything. There you go. Yeah, you have to restock if you don't, like, um... If you don't have all the all the stuff you need to beat her. So, like, if you, uh, if you have enough notes, it's not a problem, but... Um, you can just go and get them, but here we go. There's something in here. Yeah, we... Hang on, was that a, was that a note or a ring? What is that? No, it's a feather. I thought it was a ring. Comfortable? Yes, very. Very comfortable. I've, uh, I've been thinking, like, when I come home from work, I'm just, I don't think I've ever been, like, so comfy. Like, I have been, uh, this is probably, probably the best time of my life, I think. Uh, which is, uh, I don't know, I don't, I don't want to call that sad or anything, but, uh, I'm very satisfied with where my life is, like, right now. I don't know, like, everyone I know seems to think that, like, they peaked in high school or whatever. I don't know. Or maybe not. Eh. Yeah, maybe that's unreasonable. Yeah, I haven't really talked to anyone about this. I feel like a lot of people my age are like on the are on the on the, are on the decline by this point, uh, and I'm on the up and up. Like shit, I'm making money off investments. I have like my book coming out. I have like the YouTube stream, which I, <laughs> which eventually um, I'll probably, I'm probably just gonna like when I when I when I start making money off of streaming, I think I'm just gonna take that money and just invest it. I'm not gonna like spend it on anything. I'm just gonna invest it. And like if I make fifty bucks a stream, I like. That'll, that'll really radically improve my, uh, my investment portfolio, I think. Um, I mean, like, I'll be working without working. I, I think that's the real, the real magic in it, is that, like, I'll just be playing games, enjoying myself, and then, like, oh, yeah, let's just, let's just put, like, $500 into my investment account. There we go. Is there nothing in here? I'm so confused. Hey, right, hang on. I'm so confused by these rooms that have absolutely nothing in them. Like, uh, <laughs> this is the thing that I hate about Rusty Bucket Bay. I just don't remember where anything is. Alright. Where is the Jinjo? I, I haven't seen it. Like, here we go. Yeah, I think it's in here, actually. Yeah, 
Yeah, things are getting like more expensive. So like, I have uh, I've actually found myself like getting behind on my investments because uh, because like um, the thing the money I use to invest is stuff like I, I need to be pay using to uh, pay for essentials. So it's like I had to like readjust my like um, my, my my priorities uh, recently. It's uh, it's it kind of sucks, honestly. Fuck up, oh, stupid bear. Yeah, there's nothing in here. Wait, hang on. There's nothing in any of these kitchens. Okay. They made all these assets for like nothing. There's nothing in here. Okay, uh... I want to see her again. Alright, here we go. Did I get that guy? Dead. I swear this is one of the stages that take me the longest to get through, just because I die in this one area so much. Okay. Yeah, where is the... Hang on. Oh, okay. Oh no, I didn't hit the thing. Okay, hang on. So I don't think I'll be able to get through the, the barriers. Hang on. Yeah, because they're not slowing down. Oh, fuck. No! Oh! Damn it. Okay, I, uh, yeah, let's move on. I, uh, <laughs> I'm kind of sick of it. Uh, let's see this area. Alright, here we go. Where's the... Yeah, this jiggy we got. There's the witch switch jiggy that we hit. Uh, I don't remember where it is exactly. I'm not sure if it's in this room or the next one. Um, in the in the on the way to Click Clack Wood, I think it might be either. It's kind of annoying. There's nothing in here. I mean, I guess we can get a lot. Yeah, I think I think it might be in the other room. Let's go back. I didn't think this through at all. Like they could have done so much so much stuff with this with this layer, but oh well. Yeah, I'm really getting anxious to go back and play some uh, play the original uh, play play Banjo Tooie. It's been too long. All right. Uh, yeah, after after we finish this, I think we are gonna go ahead and play it. Probably not. On, probably not today, but um, it'll be on the list for sure. I never wash. I save my cash. What bitch, bro? I just cleaned my bathroom. I just did my dishes. I just did did everything. Like shit. I took a shower. Yeah, I took a shower. I uh, washed dishes and I uh, did my laundry all at the same time, and it made my water cold as fuck. So, uh... Alright, we just have the, uh, Click Clock Wood bitch switch left, and we have all the, uh, the Jiggies in Bartella's Lair. Okay, let's some... Okay, yeah, I think we have enough to, like, get to the end. Like, we still have Click Clock Wood after this. Yeah, we have the board game, but... The board game isn't really that challenging, from what I remember. I mean, it's randomly generated, and we haven't been talking to, uh... 
talking to the witch at all. I, I never talked to her. Like, I, the last couple of playthroughs, I've just kind of ignored her and just kind of gasped when I got there. Um, that's right, you gotta go back. How many notes do we need exactly? Dude, we can go now. Weird. Oh, no, we can't. It's like 760. Right? Yeah, we need like 40 more. So you need a lot of them, but not all of them. Okay. Oh, gee, I wonder where that is. Oh yeah, we wanted to play, I wanted to do Chrono Trigger tonight, actually. I wanted to play Chrono Trigger before uh, Chrono Cross comes out. I don't know, Chrono Cross is so different anyway. I'm not sure I want to play Trigger. Uh, I don't think I... I mean, I, I, was, I was in the middle of a playthrough anyway, so I think I should go ahead and finish it. Uh, let's go back. Shit. We can probably finish this tonight, honestly. We're pretty close at the end. We'll probably like come back later in 100%. Uh, but... Eh. I'm not sure I really want to 100% it. Uh, we'll probably just get started with the clock wood. Or something. There's no reason not to. Uh, Beat it today. Like, we don't. I don't think we need much more. I think we can just get, like, we don't even need more jiggies. We just need, like, the notes. So, like, we can just go to Click Clack Wood, get, like, 40 notes or whatever, and then just beat it. Yeah, yeah, I think we might just do that and then just go back and, like, casually just, uh, 100% everything else. Just so we don't get that, like, ridiculous game over screen anymore. Uh, just, just so we put a stop to that nonsense. Yeah, I think we're gonna. Yeah, I'm gonna play Donkey Kong 64 after this. Uh, then we'll probably do Banjo Tooie. Or I mean, like uh, when I beat it. Like I don't know. Should I play Donkey Rampa? It's years since I've seen my feet. What a bitch. What a fat bitch. Hmm. Do I have any, like, digital game? Yeah, I wanted to play, like, Final Fantasy IX. Ugh. Yeah, I don't know what I'm going to play after this. Like, um, Danganronpa I've been trying to get through, for sure. Should I do Fata Morgana? Mm. Yeah, I'm always preoccupied with, like, the games I need to get through. <laughs> like, uh... I don't know, I've gotten through my backlog, though. Like, all my uh, movies have been watched. Well, all my physical movies have been watched. Like, I gotta get through my anime. I gotta... Oof, there's, a lot of, there's a lot to do. All right, here we go. <laughs> hey, what? How do you open the door? Hang on. There we 
we go. All right, spring, summer, fall, and then winter. I don't know, the problem with this area is that, like, collecting everything and it can be kind of tedious because of, like, how how, how divided everything is. Uh, but I think it's actually, uh, it, it's a pretty cool idea for an area. I do generally like it. Here we go, all right. It's one of my favorite themes in the game, too. do 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 and Naughty can't get to his house, he's fucked. Hey, why is he begging me for help? Alright, whatever. I don't know why they do this for for the the crows. It just I think it happens every time you like come in here. I think if I'm just not mistaken, I always remember that. I, I don't know what it is. All right, why it's programmed to do that? But all right. A lot of these birds, too, they're gigantic. Where, like they build a tree house, I think. This tree is gigantic, I okay, it's... Should I play Resident Evil? Yeah. Dragon Quest Builders, maybe? Uh, I don't know. We'll, we'll... Hmm. No, we'll just play whatever. Let's focus on, like, playing uh, Banjo Kazooie for now. <laughs> Let's stop worrying about what I'm going to play after this. Uh, gigantic, but it's actually not that bad. Um, like, it's basically like a single path up this tree. So, like, if you just go up this tree every single time, you basically experience everything the level has to offer. So this means that you don't, uh, 
This fucker eats all of his acorns. Uh, you fucker. Squirrels in Rareware games. Like, Conker has his alcohol addiction, and this guy has his nut addiction. What, what is with them? They're all like this. Just like the fucking squirrels, man. Disgusting creatures. Okay. Oh no! Mighty Eagle. Like he couldn't, he couldn't get himself out of the egg or whatever. Probably not get everything in the first playthrough, so let's just go in. Oh, we're out of them. All right, nine more to go in this area. That series not too bad. It's a nice chill romp compared to Rusty Bucket Bad. Is there water directly below me? How do I... Oops, fuck that up. <laughs> Shit! Damn it! Oh, we've unlocked the next area, so it's not a big deal, but... How many... Yeah, we have 17 notes. Uh... Not a lot of notes in each area. I think it's like 20 in each... Um... In each zone or something like that. There might be more in the winter one or something. Okay. Bees just gave up, they were too lazy. Okay, let's go. Let's see. Should we play Paper Mario after this, maybe? Let's see... Three... Yeah, we just want to break one of them. I shouldn't have fallen off the tree, but whatever. I wish there was, like, a flying pad or something you could just use to get out, but... Alright, whatever. Alright, summer. No girls in summer dresses, but, uh, you get the, the natural beauty of the season. Need five caterpillars. Okay. Yeah, we can help you out there, Ari. Uh, where are the caterpillars? Is that one? That's a ginger. They aren't hard to find, from what I remember. But... Hungry animals like caterpillars. Straight. Yeah, we can't get it right away. We'll have to come back later.
Is there really not that much to do here in the summer? Well, I guess we can go up and see. Yeah, yeah, we have to. Yeah, okay. Yeah, that's why the leaves are there, so you can go up this way. Okay. It's like, what about the last, rest of the zone? Oh, here we go. Rest of the area. Interesting. So when you kill a guy in the, a previous zone, the the energy bar is still there. Okay, that's that's weird. So it stays there throughout the season? What, what sense does that make? Eh, whatever. Yeah, there's a lot of skulls in this area, if I remember correctly. So. Are these supposed to be tree branches? They don't look much like them. Oh, whatever. Why are they getting bigger? There's nothing in here. Okay, shit. Yeah, I don't remember how many you need for... Uh... For the B, yeah. I want to say like 35 or something ridiculous like that. This, this place has a lot of had a, has a lot of spells though, so it shouldn't be a too big of a deal. Um, The honey bear! Oh no, our natural enemy. Zubba's? I don't know, why didn't they just reuse the. Okay, whatever. Of the game. It's short, simple fun. We were getting bored of guarding it anyway. Oh, come on. You're just coping. I'm not even sure why we're getting more chickies at this point, because there's really nothing more to, to do with them. If I remember correctly. Oh, maybe you get something. Oh, you get like the true ending when you get all of them, but. Yeah, the true ending that builds up to uh the the uh the sequel that never really happened. Like with the uh with the secret codes and such swap and stop and swap. Like that's just, that is kinda weird. It's such, this game is such a classic in general, but like that that's a specific, specific aspect of that game has been completely lost. Um, because they couldn't make it work. Alright. Where am I going? What am I going to play today? I think they typically don't live up to, like, expectations. I think this does a pretty good job of being, like, chill while still being, like, challenging, you know? Like, it doesn't feel, like, as intense as Respite Bay, but uh, I don't think it needs to be. It just kind of is its own thing. Uh, I think it's a good way to end it. Like, it, like the ending itself is so intense, you don't, you don't need an intense final level, so...
sleep. Alright, whatever. He just immediately just passes out again. Until fall. Where's his parents? Like, why isn't his mother taking care of him? Yeah, I don't think there's anything in here in the summer, so I think we're just gonna... I think we're just gonna go back. How do we get down? What's an easy way to get down? There has to be a way to, to do it, but... Okay, is that it? Just jump. Just jump! Uh, hover. Yep, there we go. Easy peasy. Uh, wait, what's over here? Shit. Can I make that jump? Nope. It can. Absolutely can. I don't like. Uh. I need 10 because he's bigger. He's a growing boy. Alright. Let's put all these giant leaves. Alright. Should I go see Naughty now or should we wait a little bit more? know this level a little bit better to get all the all the notes in one go but I uh, I don't think it's that difficult to do I mean I, I was dying left and right press the bucket bad I haven't died once here <laughs> I've been waiting for months to give you this not really a puzzle but just a little help help the beaver get into his house just like Narnia, right? Well, you don't help the beaver get to his house. What does the beaver do in Narnia? Does he just tell them about Aslan and, like, uh, the, the White Witch and shit? It's been a while since I read it. I, I'm, I'm a, I, I was listening to the first one. Oh, well, the, not the first one, but the uh, the creation myth of Narnia, the, the, the first one. The Magician's Nephew. Uh, which is the first chronologically, the first in the timeline. And that's actually way, way, way better than I remember it being. Like, I think, like, the first and seventh, uh, the first and final one, are actually the best in the series, going by what I remember. Like, the line of the Witch in the Wardrobe is the most famous, uh, but I don't remember liking it that much. I don't know, I'm a lot more, like, uh, aware of religious topics now, so I might, I might appreciate it more. That, that's the thing I've noticed, like, going back to the Magician's Nephew, is like, oh yeah, it's like, here we go. Here he goes. I, I, I value that aspect of it more, I think.
we've all moved out, but you're still here, or whatever. I forgot to get the caterpillars for, uh, for Irie. Ugh. Alright, well done. Yeah, I've done this occasionally. Like, I do it once, and then I kind of forget to do it in fall. Uh, like, ten seems like... Five is, like, easy to do. Like, ten seems like too much, honestly. I think we have enough notes now to beat the game, uh, but... I don't know, we might just wait a bit. Here we go. I might just go beat it now and then just come back. How many notes do we have? Let's see, yeah, 3 out of 10 jiggies we have. Yeah, we can just come back, I think. Oh wow, yeah, you just wait. This is all you have to do is just wait for this treehouse to be finished to get it. Like, do they expect you to see it and just try to j make the jump or something? Is it, was this a trick? Was this a trick? Black one? Is it good? Okay. Oops. Ah, oh, fuck. I slipped. Oh, damn it. Can't you kill those things? You have to be able to, right? Oh, whatever. Okay, I, I think that's good enough. I think we can just beat the game now. Um, yeah, we'll probably take a break for a while before like coming back to Winter's End. I, uh, I mean, we beat Ocarina and then took a break from that. Yeah, how about Star Fox 64? Nah. Yeah, what, what else do I, what do I have physically? What else do I need to get through? I have a lot of games on my shelf. Yeah, we might switch consoles, actually. Yeah, I think we might play Chrono Trigger or something. This is like Chrono Trigger, getting, getting Chrono Cross getting released. Uh, then we'll probably come back and play Dongan or something. Yeah, the game show. This is going to be tedious. <laughs> Grunty just couldn't, like, join a gym if he wanted to lose weight. She had to, like, kidnap someone and, and transition. <laughs> like, steal her beauty? Ugh. What a bitch. Oh, no. <laughs> this is ridiculous. Okay. Didn't think so. Right. Shit. These are such fringe questions. You actually have a bunch of sisters, but okay, whatever. Mm. Yeah, yeah, easy. Too easy. Got 
Oh. It was like 50, wasn't it? Yep, yep. 75 seems too high. And one of the cool things about this uh, this board game is that, like, since it's randomly generated from the beginning, you do get, like, a, a completely different experience every time you play it, so... It, it never it never feels comes off as monotonous. It's always like something a little bit different. Yeah, I wonder who that is, Mumbo Jumbo. Ah, shit. Yellow and red. Yep. Clanker's Cavern. No, Rust. I see back. Mm -hmm. Really? Okay. Yeah, it's Fizzy Peak. Fizzy Peak is really iconic, so. It sounds like a Christmas song, so. Yeah, that was easy. Toby's Valley. Okay. And yeah, the first notes weren't very recognizable, though. My first boyfriend's name. Undead Ed. Oof. Okay. Who put up with her nonsense? Ah, shit. Yeah, three. Bottles the mole. Bottles the weasel. All right, here we go. Okay. Easy. Uh, bubble loop swab, I think. Shit, it's the same one. Okay, it must just be from a different season. Okay, okay. That's why I was kind of confused. How are you supposed to know that? Uh, blue? Ah, shit. Three, one, two. Yeah, I know this one. I had that memorized. I didn't even have to look at it last time I played. Uh, I swear I always get this one. Already? 
Where'd get that? Fuck. I love I love you. Alright, what is this shit? I can't figure this out. Where's the where's the bird? I wasn't able to get it. Oh, no. I could not get any of the... Like, if you get one matching, ah, it's easy. it gets easier and easier, but I couldn't do it. Oh, wow. That was embarrassing. That was embarrassing. Do I have to start at the beginning? You've got to be kidding. How are you supposed to know this? Oranges. That gives you me click on wood. Should I don't? Oh. Probably Rusty Bucket Bay. I don't know. I was wrong. I have no idea. I get weird angles for this shit. Uh. Really? It looks like there's a bunch. Yeah, eight. Okay. Oh, no! Blue, yellow, purple, red, purple. Shit! Eat this, okay. Blue. It's not possible to do this. Is it? No. I got it wrong. Uh, blue. Wait, no. No, I, I can't figure this out. Wow. I got my ass kicked. <laughs> There's a reason I typically stop on this board game. Ugh.
These angles don't make any sense. Okay. So it's a Hogwarts. To perform a strip tease? Oh! They threw that in there? for children. Backwards though? Okay, so E I Is that J? Yeah, J. A, B. Where is the last A? Hey, what? Oh, shit. Did I miss? Oh, I missed the N. Oh, shit. Even when you know what you're doing, you tend to get shattered. Oh, no! Like, I can't remember all these notes. It's like, hang on, I can't even get the first one half the time. We got destroyed. We got completely destroyed. I guess Grunty wins. Yeah, I think I'm ready to take a break and play something else. Um, your sister wants a word with you. Oh, that's rough. That's rough, buddy. Okay. And hey, what do I have? What am I playing? Um, Origami Kid, Dragon Quest Builders, Mario Odyssey. Now a sword. Uh, Mario Maker? Mario Maker does sound really good. I want to play, uh, I want to switch consoles, let's see. Resident Evil 4, maybe? <laughs> uh. 
It's been a while since we played anything Wii U related, so. Hmm. Let's see. Bayonetta, Origami King. Yeah, I think we're basically a. Yeah, I think we're gonna switch to Wii U. See where are my controllers? Hmm. That's for the Wii. Where's my controller for that? There it is. Oh, is my battery dead? Unexpected. Something must have been pressed up against it. I wonder if that's why it keeps my batteries keep dying. Chargeable, so it's really weird for me to be changing batteries. Uh, Hmm. You know what's in what's in the Wii U? I, I don't remember what I was playing last. I think it was I think it was Resident Evil 4, but hmm. Let's see here. It's not getting a signal for some reason. Uh Hang on. Could it be the Wii U's fault? Hang on. Oh, is it not booting up correctly? Hang on.
Oh no, is that Wii U having problems? There we go. There we go. Yeah, it didn't boot up properly. That's weird. Like, the light was on, but... Okay. Okay, uh, let's see, 4, Metro Point 3. Actually, that's Smash Bros. 4 out. Let's, let's go ahead and look at Smash 4 and see... I got Smash 4 off the shelf. Let's go ahead and see what uh what we have left to do in this game. Because there's quite a lot to do. Like, I'm, I'm basically done with Ultimate, but uh, there's actually quite a bit of stuff left for me to do in uh, in Smash 4 of the Wii U and Brawl. And I think I, I don't think I'll beat Brawl, but I think I might actually do, do Smash 4 one of these days. Because it actually does have a lot of really cool content. It's really difficult. Yeah, for Wii U is the worst uh, subtitle of all time, by the way. People don't make fun of that enough. It's just they couldn't come up with a subtitle, really. Like, just just call it, just call it U. Uh, whatever. Like, ah, shit. Okay. Let's adjust my uh, camera here. Sure. There we go. It's been a while since I played, so let's see. You can have jumped in. Yeah, yeah, yeah. They keep giving me that notification like I don't already like I don't already know. Yeah, I've played the game before. Yeah, so look at this. I have um get three or more checkpoint bonuses in a single game of Smash Tour. So uh this stuff has been really, really hard. Uh, I have not been able to beat any of it. Let's see. Clear cloak and intensity 8.0 with two or more characters. Okay, let's do the Smash Tour one first and then Yeah, let's play Smash Tour. People don't um People don't have a lot of fond memories of this, but we might as well play it. Three or more checkpoint bonuses in a single game of Smash Door. Oops, I think I pressed B by accident. It's been a while since I played any of those. Alright. Like, this is the kind of stuff I wanted to see in Smash Ultimate, right? Like, I would have loved to see, like, a really good, well-made sort of, like, side modes like this. But I just don't... I just don't really see that in general out of Smash these days. Um, Melee... Melee and Brawl had a lot of good side content. This one did, too, uh, but there was... Uh, Ultimate just does not feel like it, it was made with single players in mind. Which I suppose is probably for the best, like, generally speaking, but for me, personally. It's such a shame, because I think this game was, uh, criminally underrated when it came out. I don't... I like it a lot more than 4, for sure. Uh, Ultimate, for sure. Other than, like, the roster, I think this is the way... The way... Far superior game. Um... Here it goes. Okay. It's been a while since I played. It might be weird coming back to this. Characters might play a little bit differently than they did in Ultimate.
So what does it mean by checkpoint bonuses? How does this game work? Let's see. Yeah, what exactly is a checkpoint bonus? I, um... Uh... I don't remember exactly. Now, I'll probably this is probably one of those things I'll have to use a guide for, because I don't I don't usually play Smash Door, because it's not fun, right? Like people didn't have a people had like problems with this when it came out. Here we go. There we go. Got that. Yeah, I think people like Smash Run a lot more. And I didn't have the, um, I didn't play a lot of Smash Run either. I, I don't know, like, I didn't care for a lot of these. I mean, I like them more than the fucking spirit mode, but, in Ultimate, but it's not saying a lot. I don't know, I, I just think, like, yeah, Smash really needs to figure out, like, for me, like, the fun in Smash Bros. was just, was just, like, unlocking characters and learning more about Nintendo's history. Like, getting rid of trophies was a mistake. Um, not having a fleshed out, like, um, story mode was a mistake. I don't know. Just, I, I feel like there's a lot of stuff they could do with the franchise that they just don't. And, uh, I, I just haven't cared for, uh, I just did not care for Ultimate when it came out. Let's see. I don't think I played a lot of this either, to be honest with you, but... I don't know, maybe I'm just not a, a Smash Bros. fan. Sakurai is going to work on next now that he's done with Smash Bros. Hopefully forever. Uh, I don't want him to be working on Smash 6. I don't want Nintendo to pressure him to work on Smash 6. That would be terrible. Like, he needs to be working on new IPs. Like, it's just... Uh, I mean, I'm not... Sh he could probably afford to retire, but eh, we'll, we'll see. I don't know, I don't think we needed as many Smash Bros. games as we got in the past decade. I don't think we needed the 3DS version. I don't think we needed, like, Ultimate, really. I just, I would have just rather had, like, one good game for Switch, and then that would have been, that would have been ideal, I, I think. A Pokemon Smash, oh wow. Keep dying, I'm not doing very well. Hard to believe this game's almost a decade old. Uh, it's like probably eight years old this year, uh, November, I think. No, it's, it might be eight years. When did this come out exactly? 2014, right? Like, yeah, I think it was eight years ago exactly. Like February or something. No, 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 no. It was November 2014. The 3DS version came out like October or some shit. Yeah, what are checkpoint bonuses? All right, here we go.
you know, I'm kind of bored, honestly. I think I, I don't think I like Smash Tour, so I think we're just gonna use the hammer for that. Uh, let's see. What the fuck is this? Recover the stat boosts a Metroid stole from you in Smash Door? Ah, uh, yeah. If there's, if there's more than one, yeah, we're gonna have to play more Smash Door. Solo Classic and Intensity 8.0. Uh, can we do it? This game actually has trophies. Uh, remember when Smash Bros. used to have trophies? I'll never stop bitching about that. Alright, uh, Bayonetta, let's see. Yeah, 7.5 is the highest I've gotten. Alright. Oh yeah, I love this format. It's just you and just whoever you want to fight. You actually get to choose. I like I like the ultimate method too of just having like every character's classic mode be a theme thing, but uh, but. I like this a lot too. Here we go. I think the server, the servers for this game is, are still up. Here we go. Oops. Luigi won! Ugh. Luigi won.
Yeah, the game's hard. I don't think I'll, uh... It's gonna take a lot of practice. If I'm ever gonna 100% this. I'm not sure I ever will. I never did Brawl, and I don't think I ever will. I did Melee, but, like, I grew up with Melee, though. I think we have. Um, let's see. I think we're at the RE4 first. Give the. Um, give the old gamepad a chance to charge. Yeah, Smash 4 holds up. It's just, I don't know, like, Ultimate is better and just... <sighs> yeah, like I said, they made too many of them. Because, like, I just got done playing Ultimate, which is the main reason I decided to, uh, to play Smash 4, but... Yeah, we could do, like, Metroid Prime 2 tonight, perhaps. Oh, Metroid Prime 1, I should say, because uh, we were doing a playthrough of that a while ago. Never finish it, um, because, of course, I didn't. <sighs> Yeah, I should, get, I should probably get back into that at some point. And what other games do I have on here? There might be some more Wii games I, uh, I haven't played in a while. Donkey Kong Jungle Beat uh, comes to mind. Yeah, what else do I have on here? Ashley's dead. Where are we? Where the fuck are we? Oh, it's immediately after the cabin. Okay. She's still dying. Damn. We stopped after the cabin. Wow, what a weird place to stop playing. Um. Yeah, typically I I usually get through like uh, chapter one and two immediately and then just kind of uh, gradually I mean the first four chapters aren't very long at all it's the fifth one that takes a while I, I mean the, the entire game isn't long but welcome, welcome. I don't normally take a take a break in between sections like this that's one, that's one of the reasons I was kind of taking take it aback I was like wait a minute really I I haven't Okay. What are you buying? What are you buying? Handgun, TMP. What yeah. Are what are you selling? That's right. Come we're keeping like the original handgun hand for this game, for this playthrough, aren't we? Yeah, and, like occasionally I'll like uh, I'll like go through both paths. Like there there are treasures on both paths. So what I'll usually do, what I'll sometimes do is I'll I'll like go back through them and then like get them. I, I don't think I'll do that this time. I don't, I don't know. There's a. I don't think there's a point really. I don't want to. I don't want to worry about Ashley. So I'm just gonna have her uh, stow her away and then fight the champs right now. I love this game. Oh. The fuck? She she made a beeline right for me. Like she didn't even give me a chance to. And hopefully they don't look at the dumpster. Yeah, they're just making a beeline for me, shit. Oh, this is professional mode, so I'm gonna be wide. This thing has, like, really rapid fire. I've, I've never actually seriously used it. Uh, like, an upgraded version of this. I usually replace it right away. But honestly, like, I think it's actually really good. I, uh, 
I'm surprised how much I uh, I like using the handgun. I, I think I might actually prefer it over the uh, the more powerful versions because it fires quickly. It, it's good for like minor enemies. Uh, that, that's what it's good for, and you and you'll want your your better guns for the bosses. So. there's so many like dumpsters like you can just keep her in the first one and like nothing's gonna happen they don't they don't look in the dumpsters I don't know, honestly like you honestly gotta forget sometimes that Ashley can get kidnapped if you're like reasonably good at the game because she's not like uh The guy coming behind me. Oh, oh fuck! It's someone I wanted. Wait. That is not what I wanted at all. Uh, should I go back and save her? Actually. That is like the exact opposite of what you should do in this area. Like I was just saying, don't don't let Ashley out. But no, uh, apparently I'm an idiot. And I don't think I've ever seen a parasite jump down a ledge like that. I guess they do. Uh, oops, I guess they do still have their intelligence. Um, which is weird because they don't have brains anymore. But uh, well, they look. Show feet? No, no, thank you. No, that's not gonna happen. You guys are becoming so degenerate. You're asking men to show feet now. Are you? Are you serious? I don't know. I've always thought that like. Uh, Let's ha I'm so paranoid. I'm just gonna wait a minute. Yeah, I'm just gonna get Ashley. Ashley, what are you doing? Hide again. I'm just gonna get her to hide, hide again. Get back in the dumpster. You dumb rod. I bet you voted for Trump. Okay. Twice. Okay. I don't know, I, I like the chainsaw fight, uh, grandma fight better. I, I just think it's, uh, it's, it's just easier to handle. I like the Ganados fight is just kind of, well, kind of gimmicky, I think. Oops, that was... Yeah, they're coming right at me. Yeah, I completely under I keep I completely forgot how difficult the uh, game can be on professional. Like some of these one hit kill enemies. Alright. Get over here, you. Yeah. Oh, that's so satisfying. This is like legit one of the best <laughs> third person shooters ever made. It never gets old. Ever. Look at how they stumble. Oh man, it's so satisfying. Okay. of uh, Area 2, so I don't think it'll be too much longer until we can, uh... The fuck? 
Where the fuck is he? It was. I hear him, but I don't see him. There he is. This thing has a really cool rapid fire. I really, really like that. I should just come to find you, I think. She won't go down the ladder. Like you have to catch her. She really wants to touch you to catch her. Like shit. What a what a dork. Yeah. Ashley, there's a ladder. Use it. Uh, is a treasure up ahead? Yeah. Okay. Starts ramping up the difficulty until like maybe. Uh, maybe not until chapter 5, honestly. Um, I mean, it's a pretty manageable game overall. I don't know, I've never seen someone like who's not good play. Uh, I've always. I've always been good at it. It, it came really naturally to really Shit. Uh, yeah, I'll just throw that. There's a dumpster here, but all right. I didn't need to use it. All right. Actually, there's more. I don't even have the rifle yet. Shit. Sure. Well, a rifle, I should say. You should be kidding me. How many? How many parasites can can one horde have? Okay. What's the probability that they'll uh, they'll spot a parasite? Because it's randomized, right? I'm not entirely sure how it uh, how it happens. Like uh, like game wise, like what is the um, what is the probability that they'll sprout a parasite? Because there has to be like some kind of some kind of like formula to make sure it doesn't happen all the time. Because it's like it's it's different people every playthrough. Here we go. I'm not even gonna bother healing Ashley. She can walk around injured. Um I mean there's no point in like healing Ashley usually, because you can just like protect her. There she's not hard to defend. Um, here we go. Oh, she does a little cheering motion. Oh, that's adorable. I mean, every time I see that, I'm just like, oh. I, don't know, I played this when I was a kid. I don't know. I guess. I don't know. It's, it's little. It's little things like that, like that, that really make me like Ashley as a character. 
Uh, she comes off like a lot more like an actual person than most of it. Oh. Oh, yeah. Yeah. There goes my brilliant plan of, uh, of not, of not healing Ashley. Okay. There's no point. I can protect her. Ah, whatever. Yeah, that was, that was a bad idea. Okay. I have a, I have a green herb. Have it, Ashley, you bitch. Okay. Okay, let's try this again. Yeah, I don't have a ton of long-range weapons yet, so this is a... Uh... If I had a rifle... I don't know, like, going, going, th I remember, like, going through this area with the Chicago typewriter and just, like, just holding the fire button, like, the entire time. It's a, it has unlimited, unlimited ammo, so you just, you just end up blowing all these guys away. You don't even have to aim. It's, it's ridiculous. And she gets so excited. <laughs> She's so into it. She really likes being in an action movie. I don't know, I'm sure, like, uh... I'm sure she'll be in, like, uh, when they make a Resident Evil 4 remake, which I'm sure she is gonna be soon, uh, I'm sure she'll have, like, a bigger role, which uh, I'm kind of excited for, actually. I, um... Resident Evil 2, the, the remake for 2 was actually not that bad. I mean, it wasn't great or anything, but, like, you know, it was nice, you know, just having a remake that was actually fairly competently made, even if it wasn't, like, the best thing ever, you know? Yeah, I should probably at least try Resident Evil 3 remake. I, I, I like 2 enough that I, to the point where I think I might enjoy 3 as well. I think I will give it a shot, honestly. Um... Yeah, I'm completely out of ammo. Shit, I'm so fucked. Look at I have a boss fight coming up and I have no ammo. Just ugh. Actually, where are you where are you? Okay. Yeah, I think there are guys in here. Are there are guys everywhere. They're just chilling, hanging out. Actually, I think uh, grenades are probably... Oh, fuck. What the fuck was... Oh, that was the firecracker that I didn't shoot. Uh, I was like, what was that? What was that? All right. I use grenades so infrequently that I kind of forget I have them sometimes. Uh, okay. One hit was all I needed, wow. This blood is still fresh. Yeah, not a whole lot out here, but whatever. Yeah, I'd like to finish this this weekend, for sure. Uh, yeah, we're, we're almost at, like, chapter three, so we're a good way into Follow it here. Me. Follow me. Welcome, welcome. For a selection, For a selection. What, are what are you buying? Come back. Come back anytime. Okay, hopefully that's enough ammo to, to beat the boss. People have been talking about a Resident Evil 4 remake for a while. I I wish I could work on it, to be honest with you. I think I could come up with all sorts of shit. Like, I would come up with companions for all the characters. I would come up with, like, new situations and, like, new um, new lore. I just... <laughs> I would go crazy with it if I had the opportunity. You better stay outside. You better stay outside. Ashley, go hide. Ashley, yeah. go hide. Yeah. 
Yeah, I'm very enthusiastic about this game. I don't know. I, I even watch the cutscenes like every single time, usually. I mean, because they're badass. How is this not the coolest thing ever? And I also like how, like, the game, there are, like, notes telling you that, like, um, the chief is waiting for you down here. But, um, you know, you don't have to get them. Like, you can just go straight there. It's not like you have to, like, waste your time or anything. Right, here we go. Instead of using my incendiary grenades, I'm just going to use this gasoline instead. Hey, don't waste my precious bullet. I need that for a boss fight. I love the design for this thing. Like, I remember seeing it back in the day and just being blown away by it. Um, it's probably not nothing special now, but... Eh, I mean, maybe it is, yeah. I like it more than modern as bosses. Uh, let's see... Yeah, it's still enough, I think I can use all the grenades, let's see. Hang on. Said I, I am completely out of bullets. I have nothing to fight this guy with. He really wanted me to dodge that instead of just you know running past it. That was really easy. I'm not sure if it was the grenades or what. I swear I had a harder time. Oops. Get me with one punch. I was just gonna collect the things down here before. All right. And was it the grenades or what? What exactly did I do? I, I don't understand how that. Why that went by so quickly? All right, hang on. I can't believe he got me with one punch. Um. I tend to struggle with on repeat playthroughs. Uh, everything else is, I tend to have pretty good strategies for, but for this guy, I just, uh, I don't know. I, I think it's because uh, he hits so hard, takes so many hits, and I just, there, there just aren't a lot of opportunities to upgrade your stats, you know, at this point. Um, so I, okay. Yeah, if he's killing me with one hit, I probably should use that herb right away. Oops. Okay, I have 20 handgun bullets. Here. 
He's killing me with one hit. Yeah, yeah, it's not my strategy. It's, um... Like, he's legit so strong in his second form that, um... He's, he's taking me out. Like, there's nothing I can do. Uh... Hmm... Oh, you can't even go back there. Shit. Yeah, it's like you can't take a hit at all. It's it's unfortunate, but. Yeah, I think I'm just gonna pump him full of TMP because I don't, I don't think the TMP is what you want to use the second form. I think it's a shotgun you want to do. Okay. Okay. Yeah, we'll save the shotgun for later. Oh, okay. Red herb. Come on. Oh, yellow herb. Okay, excellent. Okay, hopefully this will help prevent the... Oh, wait, hang on. We don't have the green herb. Okay. Hopefully this will help prevent me getting one shot by this easy boss that I should just have beaten already. Like, it's just... Okay. Yeah, I'm not even gonna call it hard, because, like, after, after getting one shot after, like, perfect runs, I'm just like, yeah, it's like... It just hits too hard. I, I, I think that the second form was just too powerful. I mean, this is professional mode, but... Hang on. Got him. Kill us faster. Oh, now we can relax. All right, here we go. Sorry, I've seen Harry Potter recently. I love that movie. The first one, who else? Okay. Look how much damage that fucker did. Okay, well, at least we have a healing item. Let's see, turn around. We probably should go back and get some first aid spurs. I don't know why I didn't bother. God damn it! Yeah, I'm gonna have to get some first aid sprays. It, it's just too strong. Uh... Ah, damn it! I thought I was. I thought he couldn't reach me from where I was. All right. I was like, obviously he could. All right. Yeah, he hits too hard. Okay, let's uh, go back. Yeah, too rough, too rough. And the first form is so easy, too. Like, you've seen me like beat it like time after time. It's just... Uh... Hang on, just... Oh, you can't even get two of them because of the... Oh, shit. Alright. Yeah, I'm sure he was close to being dead, but... Okay, what is it? Is it going to be a shake, or is it going to be a AB? There we go, AB. Oh, it's a flash grenade, you idiot. That seems to, that seems to have done the trick, though, honestly. Yeah. 
was that ridiculous grab? I mean, okay, first of all, heal. Uh, actually, yeah, let's heal first. I've got another grenade, let's use that. Abuse that, I should say. Oh, fuck! We definitely need to use the get the yellow herb. We gotta max out our health as fast as possible. Uh, uh, damn it! Okay. I don't know. The handgun might actually be better over this boss than the shotgun. Because I haven't upgraded it at all. Uh, I am not letting that thing get within like five inches of me. Let's hope the fuck. I was climbing up the ladder. Let me cheat. Uh, I think I died so much against the boss it got easier. That, that happens in this game sometimes. Uh, let's see. Yeah, let's go ahead and just get a higher HP rating. And the more you die in this game, like, the easier it gets, so... Uh, I wish that didn't happen. I wish you could turn that shit off, but... Uh, yeah, he's not as aggressive. Yeah, because, like, whenever I beat a boss in this game, it really does feel like I don't actually beat it. The game just gets easier, and I just win. I doing the same thing, it doesn't... It kind of sucks. Um, too strong. I can't... Alright. He's taking so many hits. That first phase is so easy. Like, why am I struggling? Alright. 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 Uh... I definitely can beat him. It's just... It's just one of those cases where I'm just like, yeah. Gonna be AB again. Oh, maybe the flash grenade would be good against the uh, the upper phase. Hang on, we'll try that next time. I I've never actually tried that. Maybe that would be a good technique to use. Against Krauser, you want to use a knife. So I wonder if like that works against bosses too. I've never actually tried that. Let's see.
Got him. Maybe I should try the TMP against it. I think like the TMP has better range. So it might actually work out a little bit better. Let's see here. I don't want to lose all my health, but. I don't I cannot stand how uh why is it take I how is my health in the green and I'm getting getting knocked around? Uh, all right. Yeah, I think we'll try. I think we'll try saving the TMP for the fight. For the fight, honestly, it's quicker. It has longer range. Um, we'll use the shotgun first. Yeah, I was kind of reluctant to do that because like it was work. The strategy was working so well for the first phase, but. Um, Yeah, my shotgun sucks, so I probably should just use it first. Because this boss is so easy to deal with. I mean, this form is so easy to deal with. Uh, let's see. So I'm gonna just take this thing, use that, switch to TMP. I was hitting him right now. Was I missing? I'm not sure whether that was a success or a failure. I kind of felt like I missed all those shots, but.
Got him. Actually managed to pull it off. Wow. Now that was rough. Fun fight though, for sure. And usually, yeah, it's usually after this point where I stop and take a break. But uh, yeah, I think I will still I keep playing into chapter three. I'm having a blast. I I love this game. Okay. Thirty thousand pesos. Where's the way out? It's right over here, isn't it? Fuck. Oh, there it is. I'm Leon. Are you okay, Leon? Are you okay, Leon? Oh, she's legit concerned about me. It's not even a cutscene or anything. She just has a voice clip. It's surprisingly sweet. I don't know, you're not exactly friends or anything, but, like, you really do feel like, uh, you feel invested in making sure Ashley's safe. It's way better than The Last of Us. Because, like, Ashley can actually get kidnapped. Like, she can actually die, you know? Um, I'm not sure why these villagers have this have this lift, but all right. I don't know. I just I just love the environments in this game. It's so bleak and unsettling, and it comes off as like really natural at the same time. Like mostly, usually I, I think these kind of like brown is realistic areas are kind of lame, but this kind of makes it work. This does make it work. Um, it's probably the best game of its kind, actually in that, like, uh, artist artistic direction style. There we go. They have a retinal scanner? Like, they act like they're part of a, uh, a primitive village, almost. This took me forever to figure out. Oh, I had no idea what I was doing when I first saw this. Doesn't even make any sense. And then there are like a bunch of dudes in the back just chilling. They just spawn out of nowhere. I don't understand that. They just they just appear. Hang on, shit. Yeah, that's the last time you see the, the, the classic villagers in the game. Uh, they disappear after this.
side of the bridge. Yeah. Wait a minute! Video Game Lover 58 subscribe to your channel? What? Wait, hang on. That's going on my Discord. What the fuck? Hang on. Come on. Yeah, I have video evidence of it. Like, I, I have a picture. BGL. Like, what are you doing? Watching me play art. Alright, whatever. Welcome, welcome. Yeah, I love the castle. It's probably probably the best area in the game. I, uh, I really love the aesthetic. I mean, I love castles in general. I want to live here. Like, I am not even joking. I want like to build a replica castle of those and just live in it. Uh, here we go. Uh, let's see. All right. Uh, let's see here. Yeah, shotguns, all that shit. That old that old yeah, I don't have anything else. Uh, what okay, we're gonna get a yeah, treasure map, castle. Yep, yep, need that for sure. Blacktail, broken butterfly. Don't they? Do they give you a broken butterfly? Or I think they do. Shit, I actually don't remember. I don't remember ever buying one, but. Is that all? Am I incorrect? I think the riot gun's actually better than the striker, if I'm remembering correctly, right? Uh, my idle rifle. No I'm completely no Mind thrower. Oh, oh, that's what you get when you beat the game for the first time, isn't it? Yeah. Okay. Yeah, I don't believe I typically use it, because you don't have enough space for, like, all of this shit in uh, some secret playthroughs. Um, yeah, I tend to just use, like, the, the normal stuff. Unless I'm, like, deliberately Sorry, doing, like, a uh, Chicago typewriter run or something. I don't know, I'd like to play around with some of these, uh... <laughs> some of these, uh, some of these things. Let's see. Thank you. Thank you. Thank you. What are you buying? I don't have enough for the fucking semi-auto rifle. Are you serious? How am I gonna win without? Okay, hang on. Okay. Come. Uh, I guess that's what I get for not upgrading the uh, shotgun. Yeah, because if you upgrade the shotgun and then sell it, you get it for more. So maybe. Hmm. Maybe it would have been better if I had used it for something. Yeah, it's not ready. Shit. Uh. I guess we're gonna have to use the uh, the shitty rifle. <laughs> Funnily enough, and then we'll just sell it. We have. Uh... I don't tend to use the rifle a lot. Like there, there are some designated areas where you absolutely have to use it, but generally speaking, I don't use it. Thank you. First aid spray. Yeah, we should probably get some healing. Yeah, I thought it was on top of everything, but it feels like I. Uh... Feels like I got fucked. Uh, handgun. Okay. Yeah, everything. Yeah, look at look at this. All this, all this upgrade stuff that I can't afford. Shit. Because I had to buy so much stuff. All right. Okay. Yeah, I think I will go ahead and upgrade the ride gun. Uh, this way through. Oh, it has a drawbridge and everything. Oh, I want it. Re four. Yeah, that like Re four. Uh, one of the best. The best are you game, for sure. I don't know why I said one of the best. Yeah, it's either this or Resident Evil Remake. I uh, I haven't played enough of RE Remake to really decide, but uh, I, I don't know. I think it depends on your preferences, obviously. I think RE Remake might actually be better, but uh, I just I just enjoy action games, honestly. But when it comes to like pure classic Resident Evil goodness, you can't you can't beat RE Remake. Yeah, I really gotta play more uh, classic RE. I, I really do like it, but I just I have not gotten into it yet. Here we go. Oops. Oh, oops. That fucker. Yeah, I'm about to die. 
5,000? Shit. Oh, I guess I could just use, use this. Use the 5,000 get another get another 5,000. I almost always get the, 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 the semi-auto. I, I am not used to using the... Um, the regular. Boy. What are you buying? So I'm kind of concerned. Oh, okay. Wait, hang on. Oh, because I have the herbs. Okay, shit. Well, whatever. Yeah, the game doesn't like you having more than two first aid sprays. They don't. They don't want you abusing it. Which is kind of cool, actually. It's a good way to stop you from uh, abusing the system. I, mean, I don't really think I need the automatic rifle, but I, I prefer having it, you know, just... Well, why not have the best rifle in the game, you know? Take this, Palpatine. And they don't even notice when you, when you shoot them like this. It's ridiculous. What are you doing, Leon? I love how we shoot these guys without even, like, confirming whether or not they're friendly. <laughs> but they obviously aren't. Like, shit, look at those cloaks. Look at those, those, fucking, those fucking costumes. Okay. Um, yeah, this, this level, like, I don't think there's a single bad area in the castle. Uh, actually, I don't think there's a single bad area in the entire game, but... Um, I think on professional difficulty, Ashley tends to... get kidnapped on a... You can just leave her around, so let's keep her down here. Oh shit. How'd they get me at that angle? <sighs> okay, uh Eh, we might need a might find a yellow herb. <sighs> oh we need to save money, yeah, okay. We don't have one now, so. As he came into the window, it was the sound of a crescendo. Okay. A lot of treasure here, as I recall. Oh damn it! I knew there was a yellow herb up here. All right, whatever. We'll we'll use it next time. Yeah, fuck you. Yeah, those guys don't take a ton of. Those guys. Uh, those guys don't take a ton of hits. I guess just because they're so uh, far out of reach. Or whatever. Leon's putting a stop to all these Palpatine clones. Disney won't be able to continue ruining Star Wars. Uh, hang on. Oh, I just love the architecture so much. This, this castle is gigantic. I've like, it has to be worth like millions of dollars. Like, uh, I've, I've looked at castles uh, for sale in like Europe and stuff like that. They're typically like, uh, I've uh, I've thought about buying ones that are worth about like two uh, two million. Uh, this has to be worth significantly more than that. Uh... Oh fuck yeah, I knew it. Oh, fuck is she? I don't know where these guys come from. I don't. There's nowhere they can come from, honestly. Wait, where, where'd she go? I didn't even see her. Okay. Follow me. Follow me.
and did they just see her? I, I don't know. I, I don't understand how that, how they find her in there. I don't know, oh, whatever. Yeah, that, that's happened before. Um, let's see. I guess I'll keep her in the shack this time. Wait. Wait. Oh, did we get them all? I think we did, actually. This area has such a good first impression, I think. Like, the architecture is gorgeous, the, the puzzles are cool. You get to use cannons? Ah, oh, the blow up in their castle gate. Oh, I love it. Yeah, how much would this castle be worth, realistically? Like, I, I'm guessing, like, $20 million. Like, it, it's gigantic. I don't know, that, that, that's like one of the things I want to do when I, if I get like, if I ever make like billions of dollars, is that like I'm just going to make, recreate like locations like this from, uh, from classic games, like Luigi's Mansion, Peach's Castle, this, like it's all stuff I want to do. Uh, I would want to do, uh, okay, let's see, red nine, black, uh, scope, first dance for me. Is that all? <laughs> what are you buying? Oh, I, I still don't have enough cash. Cash? Okay. I guess. What are you buying? What are you selling? Do I have enough? Or, uh, we'll just keep the rifle. It doesn't matter. I don't think you need the semi automatic, to be honest with you. Yeah, it's been three hours. Leon, where's your current Leon, location? Where's your current location? We decided to lay low in a castle, but it looks like it was a bad move. Meaning, meaning. Well, it appears that this castle is also connected with the Los Illuminados. Must, must not get many visitors here, because they're giving me one hell of a welcome. Sounds bad. Sounds bad. I have an idea, Leon. I have an idea, I Leon. I need you to... Right. What? Hunnigan? Repeat, Hunnigan. Just Free. my luck. Just my luck. Oh, no. Hunnigan's gone. Never to appear again. I think she she might be in six actually. That's the rifle. Uh, I don't have any. Wait, I don't have any. Yeah, I only have some some shotgun shells. Shit. The platinum sword. I thought it was the silver sword or whatever. Whatever it doesn't matter. Why? Why is there just? Money and bullets flying everywhere. I, I, don't, I don't understand that. This game is so gamey. It's, it's great. And these guys are just chilling. Pull their heads off. It's so satisfying when you get this gun for the first time. Damn it, they got me! Okay. It's just because I ran out of bullets. Ugh. There's so many of them that I can't even like keep my gun loaded. Okay, we load. Oh, that's the that's the, that's the rifle. Is, but you can always tell whenever they're uh, whenever, uh, whether or not they're gonna get a parasite or not. Like sometimes they fake you out, but 
try to pick you up. I can always tell. I don't. It's the way they, uh. It's the timing, I think. You gotta be kidding me! Where, where did this fucker come from? Honestly, maybe I should just use the rifle and just blow heads off. And the good thing about the rifle is that, like, it's really strong. If it wasn't so slow, it'd be, like, one of the best guns in the game. Okay. Okay, got it. Some idiots, come on. Oh fuck! Actually, get back! He was like nowhere near. Wait, she was. He was nowhere near me. The kick, like that was that was a really weird shot. Did you see that? One shot on me, I probably should have healed. Fuck that. I'll just buy another first aid spray when I get to the when I get to the merchant. He's everywhere. So. got destroyed. Uh, great. Now I gotta heal Ashley, too. How many bullets can that motherfucker take? Hang on. She's gonna get uh, kidnapped soon, so I think I'm just gonna, I think I'm just gonna like leave her like this and then just heal her. Oh, but when you play as her again, she gets. Uh... I don't have any. I don't have anything. It's a good thing I had this rifle, and he's so slow. But okay. Take that. What do I do now? Let's move on. There was a treasure I didn't get? I don't remember that. Okay, I guess we can go back and get it real quick. Uh, I don't remember that treasure, but alright. I guess I need to check my map more frequently. It's been a while since I've played this. No, it's been lagging in general. I think, uh, yeah, I think my system needs to be updated. It's, uh, it's something. I completely forgot to get that. All right. Yeah, I'm not sure exactly what's going on with that. Now that you bring it up, I did notice it, but I wasn't sure if like it was a problem. Let's see, Elgato. I guess we can refresh it. Hang on.
Okay, I think that did it, honestly. Okay. Yeah, it looks better going by what I've seen. I, I, don't, I don't know. I think it happened when I switched from, uh, switched to Wii U. Okay, Red Herb. All right, let's go. Uh, what a top tier puzzle. Just switch the stores. <laughs> Just switch the swords. The game, it's so big brain. Okay. For you guys. Yeah. Yeah, he dropped it. The motherfucker had one job Shit. and he completely he, he completely blew it. Drop what? A drug that'll stop your convulsions. Look, I know you're a carrier. You've been coughing up blood, right? Yeah. And we haven't seen that in cutscenes. Damn it. The eggs have hatched. We don't have much time. What are you talking about? I have to go back and get it. Let me come with you. No. You stay here with Leon. He's better with the ladies. Why is she so eager to go with him? That doesn't... Does she want the, the drugs? Why are you... It makes me feel better. Let's just leave it at that. How did he get through the drawbridge anyway? Where did he come from? Well, anyway. Eh, well, whatever. Uh... Wait. Wait. Motherfucker heard me. Uh oh, come on. Yeah, they run up to me and then they start like doing like the jaunt thing, like where they start like doing the stagger walk. Come on. The longest escort mission ever. Yeah, for sure. Well, you don't have actually that much, that often, and and it's not that bad, honestly. Um, like people talk about Ico being a good escort game, but I, I think this is probably better, honestly. I'm not a fan of Ico, for the record. I think people only craze it because it's a PlayStation exclusive. Oh, fuck! <sighs> Damn it. Wait. Wait. That motherfucker. What is this douchebag doing? He was just—he was just staggering around. Okay. I can't stop it. Damn it! I can't even run away. Okay, so I have like the shittiest rifle in the game. I don't even have the automatic because I couldn't afford it. <sighs> okay, shit. Have nothing else. I don't even have like a grenade, I think. Oh, I have, a, I have an incendiary grenade. Okay, uh, that might work. Maybe? Uh, okay, we'll just use that in a pinch. Wait. Wait. I think you might have to do like play this like a stealth mission. Oh, what? Bullets, bullets, give me bullets. Okay. Okay, we are good. Okay, hang on. Sorry, actually, there's a bunch of guys in there. I only have 10 bullets. Fuck you. 
Oh, I did the suplex. Fuck! And the suplex is not the thing I needed to use, because he's behind me now. Ah, fuck. Thanks a lot, game. Okay. I didn't even... I, I forgot... I forgot about that. It's been a while since I, like, used the suplex. They're not even dying! Okay, that's another thing. I, they will not stay dead. All right. They won't drop ammo? Oh, here we go. Okay. Did that thing just try to eat Ashley? Yeah, she doesn't have she doesn't have headless deaths. Apparently it can though, okay. But they're not supposed to do that. Can the parasites not like like control themselves when they're out of the body like that? Wait. Okay, that's uh This is the most this is the most trouble I think I've ever had with this area, just because I don't have the right rifle. But, like if I had a faster firing rifle, it would be no problem, but alright. They're so quick, I can't do anything about it. Okay. Okay. Yeah, that's really all I needed, so I think... Yeah, if I just had, like, one shotgun blast, I would have been fine, but no. Okay. Lev's getting filtered by classic R reaction. <laughs> yeah, for sure. I don't. I don't know. I. I really don't think Cap modern Capcom could make a, a proper remake of this. Uh, I, I'm not against the idea. I think they could like make more campaigns and like just expand the story and stuff. Um, I don't know. The game's almost 20 years old. I think it can be updated a little bit, but. Uh, against the idea of being it being remade, but I don't think it would work. Okay, oops, hang on. I mean, people only talk about a remake now, because, like, uh, the RE2 remake is really the only game that uh, PlayStation owners has got in, like, the past several years. Oops. Oh, fuck, hang on. Oh, shit. Fuck, 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 fuck. I cannot believe I pulled that off. Okay, that was uh, that was one of those crazy shots. Okay. Follow me. How did she know that she needed to follow me? Did she get nervous? I didn't yell or anything. Okay. Fuck you. Oh, look at those bullets. They're all rifle bullets, dude. Ah, shit. That is the worst. Aw, oh, man, I can't wait for the more bullets. Rifle bullets. I don't need more rifle bullets. I need more TMP. I need more shotgun. I need more handgun. I don't need... Just give me a... Just give me TMP, okay? Like... Fuck, we can't do it. I don't have enough power. Okay. 
<sighs> Did more of them come in, or is that it? Yeah, okay. Yeah, I wasn't sure if they would come past Ashley if, like, if they just spawn or whatever. Ah, is it where I meet Salazar? Mr. Scott. Come on, if he was already out there. <laughs> it's Dr. Insano, shit. When are you making a new video, Spoonie? Who are you? Me llamo Ramon Salazar, the eighth Castellanatis magnificent architecture. I have been honored with the prodigious power from the great Lord Saturn. I've been expecting you, my brethren. No thanks, bro. <laughs> I love the dialogue. If you care for your own well being, I suggest you surrender yourself and simply become our hostage. Or, Mr. Scott, you can give us the girl because you're not worth a penny, I'm afraid. You can die. Unless he, like, becomes, like, super strong or whatever. I'm never turning into one of them. Never! Got that right. We'll find a cure. He's so confident about this. We'll find a cure. But, Leon, how are we going to find a cure without, um... All right. Without the help of the United States government. All right. Yeah, yeah, yeah. Yeah, the mid 2000s was better than now. I don't know, man. Um, like, when it comes to video games, I feel like Nintendo is better than they were back then, honestly. Um, you know, playing playing the old Nintendo games, I think Nintendo games are better. Like, third parties, yeah, third parties have declined, but like Nintendo, like, uh, uh, who've always been the best anyway, are better. I don't know. I, just, I have a hard time, I have a hard time saying that, like, oh, um, games are bad now when, like, Breath of the Wild exists, for example, when Dra uh, Dragon Quest Builders exists, when, uh, you know, Mario Odyssey is so good. Like, there, there's so many good games on Nintendo consoles. Like, it, it's difficult for me to say that gaming has gotten worse the way I was telling people, like, 10 years ago. Like, I, I think gaming has gotten better, uh, for, to be completely honest with you. It, he took some vaccines? Oh, no. So he has the fucking vaccines. Oh, no. Just kind of standing in there. Why is he in prison? What? I don't even remember what this uh, this guy's name is. I just remember he's annoying. in the game if he didn't have that like specific weakness. Oh, Resident Evil. 
Evil, love Resident Evil. Oh, oh fuck. Yeah, I'm using rifle bullets because I don't want to. I don't want to waste the real bullets on this fucker. seen him on the stairs. Okay. Okay. Yeah, she probably freaked out for a second, too. Oh, here we go. I, I don't know. You can just ignore the third-party oh. games, though, I think. Right? I don't know, like, I'm not buying them. So it's like, eh. I don't know, I, I think smaller smaller studios are making a comeback. Like, uh, Square, Square Enix, right? Like, uh, Dragon Quest is uh, taking off in the West. Like, you have uh, the Octopath Traveler team. Like, you have you have stuff like that. Like, they're, they're remastering their classic stuff. Like, uh, they're better off than they were 10 years ago, I think. Like, Kingdom Hearts has finally come to Nintendo consoles. Like, uh, I think there's uh, a lot of good things about the current gaming industry. I, I don't know that. I uh, I don't. I think Nintendo won. I think they managed to save the gaming industry. Like the problem is that like uh, the economy is going to collapse. So that's that's uh, now we have to deal with like the economic fallout of that, which is uh, going to be crushing. Uh, I think. I don't know. Like, we'll we'll see. It should be. The, the thing I, like, the thing, the thing I noticed is that, like, it's going to be very, very easy to start fixing the problems when, like, uh, people are ready to do it, you know? Uh, like, people just don't want to do anything, you know? They're, they're lazy. And honestly, I don't have uh, problems myself, so it's like... There's nothing for me to fix, honestly. Like, when it comes to my lifestyle, like, there's nothing I would change. Like, I, I'm, uh, I'm investing so much that I'm keeping ahead of inflation. I have, uh, you know, several sources of income at this point. Like, if I didn't come from absolutely nothing, I would probably already be a millionaire, to be completely honest with you. Oops. Oh, fuck! What the fuck was that? He killed Ashley with the... Fuck. <sighs> Don't tell me I have to do it again. I do! Fuck, that was stupid. I didn't know he had a grenade. Wait. Wait. Okay. Yeah, first time I think I've ever died in that corridor. stairs. I've never seen him do that. To be fair, I think I, I think I typically manage to
As long as developers with Nintendo DNA exist, the industry will be fine. True. Like, it doesn't take, like, a lot of good people to uh, to make society a good, you know, to make an industry good. You know what I mean? Like, you can just ignore the bad shit. Um, so, yeah, in this case, like, Nintendo has become so prevalent. I don't think, um, I don't think we're ever going to see a return to the, uh, the oh. glory days of uh, Sony just buying out every every Nintendo partner. Like that, that just isn't gonna happen. They're paying for exclusive content the way they used to. Because it's not it's not working anymore. Like they're trying, but with Microsoft like in the industry, undercutting them. Or like outbidding them, and Nintendo like actually pulling in like the talent developers, like there's nothing they can do. Like uh, they, they just don't have the business sense to succeed. Here we go. Wait. Wait. Where's the grenade? I don't I don't see the grenade. Who had the grenade? I was down here I was killed by a grenade who had who threw the grenade uh, it was like it was like a firecracker actually I have like seven bullets. Oh no, it's the water room! I completely forgot. I have like five bullets. I'm fucked. Okay. I completely forgot. Ah, oh, fuck. I thought... Shit. I have seven bullets! Holy shit! This is worse than Angry Joe and his $7. Like, I have seven bullets to take on the water room. Like, one of the most notoriously difficult rooms in the game. Okay. Uh, I can't see. This isn't gonna end well. this room at all it doesn't it doesn't make any sense like like what is this water what what is what are they trying to accomplish Yeah, I'll probably have to stream for like uh, I can probably stream for another three hours or so. Uh, I have a I have a dentist appointment actually, so I'll have to I'll have to leave unfortunately a bit earlier than I would like. But oh well, I, I've been having fun though. 
for sure, though. Okay, let's uh, strike them down. With great. Okay, here we go. Shit! I would love to strike them down if I had a bullet. No bullets. Okay. None. Well, they just ran into the. Okay, I don't need that. I need actual, actual, uh, not a single bullet. Um, come on, do something. Jack on. Okay, I got him. They have shields. Shields are even worse because you can't knife them. Uh, shit. Uh,. Okay, I think I got it. How did I beat two guys with shields with no weapons? <laughs> Bullshit! <sighs> that was a complete... Seven bull... Seven bullets? <sighs> okay. Hang on. Yeah, we're gonna have to heal Ashley because I think of that. Uh... Five bullets, okay. Honestly, I think I'm gonna switch to the handgun. He's fuck, fuck Ashley, I guess. Help! Help, Leon! Making fun of her must have been such a meme back in the day. I actually don't really have the experience of playing this one when this first came out, so. Look at them, they're everywhere! I've never seen so much fire in the game. Ah, right. oh, shit. More of them? Oh, yeah. They're, <laughs> they're feeling sorry for me now. They're just giving me guns. Okay. Uh, I hate this room. Like, I... The only time I ever really... Uh, I don't want to say I struggle with it. Like, uh, the only time I ever really feel, like, agitated in this game, I'm like... But I'm doing this room because like it just does not let up ever. Maybe like after you get the maybe after you get the uh, the lever twisted. But that takes a while. You have a lot of guys to kill before that happens. And I think they keep coming out too, so I think you have to like protect Ashley while she does it. Um, I mean, you can do it yourself, but it's like eh. I think it's better to have Ashley do it. Ashley got hit. Fucker. Yeah, I don't think like any other room in the game has like unlimited waves of enemies coming at you. I had six. What the fuck? They gra No. Damn it. I don't think any other room in the game has, like, unlimited waves of enemies coming at you. So it's, like, really difficult to... Handgun bullets, yeah. Yeah, I believe the chapter ends immediately after this round, but... I keep forgetting it's so early in Chapter 3. Like, every time I'm, like, surprised that it's so soon. That, like, I'm doing it. Uh, yeah, fuck you. Come on, Ashley, let's go. Why are they killing her? 
Okay. I am not doing a very good job protecting Ashley. Uh, that, that's the big thing that uh, I'm struggling with right now, is it, I cannot get Ashley to, to not die. All right. I knew I should have made her wear that suit of armor. Shit. I mean, that, that's unfair, though, because the game wasn't designed around that. It's a, it's a nice bonus costume, but it's like, eh, I don't want to do that. It's good if you hate dealing with Ashley, but it's like, eh. I like playing the game legitimately. I have the, I have used the armor before. Uh, I mean, it's fun. Like, you know, like Chicago typewriter, like, armor run. <laughs> like, it's practically impossible to die. Here goes. Wait. Let's see. Damn it, I'm sick of these parasites. Alright. Look, I just want to move on, okay? I just want to save Ashley. Don't you want to live? I'm not getting any bullets. I think the fucker just made a beeline right for Ashley. Come to think of it. She does? I don't know. Does she not know how to make... So he just attacked her twice! No. What the fuck? Why did he kill... You need her! Okay. Like, I keep expecting them to just, like, kidnap her or something, and I could just kill him, but... Uh, no, that's not how it works. Apparently they want her dead in this room. Uh, okay. Oh yeah, speaking of Angry Joe, did anyone else, anyone else notice he didn't, like, do a reaction to the uh, Nintendo Direct? Like, he, he's talking about, like, fucking... It wasn't Ghostbusters, it was Star Wars or something. Like, who the fuck cares? Like, stop stop talking about Star Wars, it's, it's never gonna recover. There's so many of them. Okay. Come here, stop. Okay. Uh... Oh, hang on. I keep forgetting to upgrade. Uh... Spurred out when I got to this room last time I streamed this too. Wait. Um, I don't think I had my, this much trouble. Like every time I come in here, it's always a different problem. Like whether it's like usually it's like the the crank, but this time I'm struggling with like uh, getting getting out of this room. Well, with the lack of bullets, I think it's always something. You know. I probably should be pressing Ashley. So this doesn't so that she doesn't die again. Oh shit, hang on. I don't have any bullets. Nothing is working. I can't keep him away from me. Alright. Yeah, you can't do shit, guy. Bro. Everywhere. Wait, why is that guy leaving? That other guy's running away. Is he scared? That motherfucker just ran away. Hang on, you can't just run away from Leon S. Kennedy. Why why did he run away? Alright, here, here we go. Oops. Good thing I had one bullet, but did Yeah, if I if I didn't have like that one bullet equipped it, I would be I'd be I'd be I'd be I'd be fucking dead. 
So I wouldn't have had time to reload, apparently. Right. Empty. I have two bullets in my TMP. Uh, Shotgun, shells, handgun. There we go. <laughs> Bitch. I love how she darts behind you. It's, it's adorable. Okay. Okay. Shit, come on! Fuck, 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 fuck. Uh, we missed each other? What the fuck? We were trying to, like, do battle, and we both missed? What the fuck? It was not meant to be. You were not meant to die today. Okay, uh... Okay, shit. This is ridiculous. Okay. Like, I can't get a good shot in. I can't go up there. There's too many of them. Alright. Oh, what the fuck? He jumped up the ceiling! What? Huh? Where did that motherfucker come from? I've never seen... I have never seen that happen before. I have never seen that happen. I had no idea that was possible. What? Look at this. I'm completely out of resources. I have nothing. Okay. Um. Give me guns. Give me bullets. Okay. Good, good, good. Ah, the rifle! Are you serious? Out of everything you could have gotten me... <sighs> yeah, it's gonna be another rifle, isn't it? No, it's a handgun. Anymore. Okay. That's not quite as bad. I mean, it's only ten bullets, though. Yeah, I did kill her seven flops. I, I know, uh, I know Wonderful 101 did. I don't know, man. I, uh, Killer 7 was always niche. I don't know. It was, I don't think that game was ever going to be successful. Um, I mean, that, that's kind of what makes it special, but um, that's kind of what I like about it is that like it's so so niche. Like it's that game for like people who aren't clever. Okay, we almost got most of them. Oh, Where are the archers? Oh fuck, here we go. Oh, what? Where'd that come from? Wait, what the fuck? Huh? Wait, I don't know what... Ashley, come back. We're gonna have to... What the fuck was that? Okay, this is becoming a nightmare. Um, I 
This is the roughest uh, attempt at the water room I've had in a long time. Uh, last time, I it didn't take me that long, I think. I, I was annoyed by it, but it was just like, yeah, it took me a couple of tries, but uh, it was it was on normal difficulty. It wasn't nearly as rough. Yeah, maybe I should just, like, you know, knife them as they come into the room or something. I guess we're going to have to, like, build up ammo or something, because I need, like, 500... I'm gonna need like 500 like uh, bullets or something to kill all of them. Like they just will not die. All right. Cause like it's not a difficulty problem. Like I can, I can handle like the actual challenge of handling these guys, but like I just don't have any bullets, and there's so many of them. And like it's a puzzle, so you can't like, you can't like, um, like be, you can't like just go ahead. And just try to you know, blow through the area. Like you have to fight them all, and it's just well, it's not really a puzzle. But you you have to like go back around and just. Shit, Ashley. Out of bullets. Uh, fuck. Oh, I have TMP. Okay. Uh, should I... I'll just use that on Ashley. She doesn't die again. I mean, this is what I mean when I say the game is endlessly entertaining, though. Like, how many times have I done this room, and yet I'm still, like, struggling with it? It's, uh... Like, it might be my build, it might be my, my, uh, my play style, but, like, I just have to always have that pop off of the room. At least on, like, the higher difficulties. I think on normal I have it licked, but... taking pity on me, but... Because I'm so terrible at this. Here we go. Shotgun shells. I need some rifle bullets, actually. So I can deal with those crossbowmen. Oh, TMP. Ooh, the TMP is probably, like, the thing that I need the most right now, honestly. He just shreds right through everything. Like, there's nothing they can do to stop it. Other than, like, just wait for me to run up bullets. Yeah, they just keep coming. Uh, yeah, they keep sending more guys with shields. I, I'm gonna have to deal, go up there and deal with them, but I don't know how. Uh... Where are the where are the where are the crossbowmen? Yeah, they are. Okay. Yeah, they're up top. You're gonna have to. I need rifle bullets first of all. Some PMO. Yeah, they can't. Yeah, they're perfectly positioned to go to shoot me. I don't think they're there on higher diff on lower difficulties. I don't remember seeing them last time. If they did, I probably just had more ammo. Uh, uh, yeah, it's the range. Okay, I think I can get them with the uh, TMP. So I think I'm just gonna load the TMP, get into position, shoot them both, and then have Ashley just put the crank while I defend her. I think I'll be able to manage that. Okay, switch the TMP, switch. 
I didn't even I didn't even flip the switch yet. <laughs> Damn the laugh thing is just like... I'm not sure if I killed him, but I hope I did. I didn't even I didn't even pull the I didn't even push the switch. I was so preoccupied with like how I was gonna handle those archers. Okay, I think I got them both. Um, if not, it shouldn't be a big deal. It's a good thing we have two people. If it was like three people, I have no idea what we would do. Wait. Like if it was three switches, like we wouldn't be able to proceed with the game. I can't believe I've been streaming for four hours. Oh. It feels like I, I've been streaming like so much lately. It's uh, it's kind of bizarre how much um, how much I've been getting done. And like it's not like I'm doing it's not like I'm not doing anything else either. I'm working on my my next book. Like Lord Frey is coming out tomorrow, actually. So uh, I'm really excited for that to finally come out for people to. Finally get to experience it. Um, I worked really hard on that one. I probably should have just knifed him. I don't know what I was doing. Uh, yeah, I, I should probably yeah use the handgun. In this specific situation. Actually, I should probably switch to that. Yes, excellent. Okay. Did we get both uh, archers? Let's check first. Looks like I did. Yeah, looks like I got both of them. Yeah, I only have to keep them away. Like, once we get the crank turn, we can just go up there. They just kind of fuck off after that. I think we're getting there. I think we got it. Ah, shit, do I have any healing items? I think I do. I think we're good. Uh, I think I burnt myself with the fire. Shit. Oh, they got Ashley! Fuck! How many of them are there? I should go back to the crank after you, uh... No, she doesn't. Fuck. Uh... I have another... Okay, we'll use the flash grenade for that. How many times am I gonna have to switch weapons because I keep running out of bullets? Okay, kick his ass. Okay. What the fuck? Wait. What? The archers respawn too? Where are they coming from? Alright. Hang on, let's back off for a bit. Ashley, come with me. Where is she? There she is. Okay, let's let's see if we can get, get them to drop more healing items, and then we'll, we'll have to grind this out. This is ridiculous. Um, we have enough bullets to survive, but... Yeah, we're going to have to do this really conservatively. Yeah, let's heal. Because, like, either one of us could die. Like, yeah, of course he comes up from behind us. Like, they endlessly respawn. There's nothing you can do. Okay. Yep, Parasite too. Ugh. Now I don't even have a... No, oh, hang on. Let's see the hand grenade. I should do it. I missed! Fuck. You can't even knife him because, like, that's the one that, uh... That will automatically just kind of... Shit, shit, shit. Got him. Come on, give me healing. Come on, 
healing, healing, healing. Come on. What are these people doing? All right. Did we get them all? There's a crossbowman, but I think I can just shoot him. Where'd he go? I don't see him. Oh, there he is. Got him. Holy crap. Yep, they come down with the scythes. Oh, fuck. I'm so... I'm so scared. I ran right towards them! No! Fuck! No! No! Epic fail. I think if you go up the stairs, you can, like, uh, you hit a checkpoint, too. Fuck. That was stupid. Unbelievable. All right. Uh. Oh, hang on, I didn't actually use it. Uh. Sony fanboys have been asking for games for the streets. I, I, don't, I haven't heard anything about that. I... Do Sony fanboys even exist? I... I haven't seen, I haven't, I've, um, everyone I know is playing on Switch, like, exclusively. I, I don't associate with Sony fans, I have no idea what they're talking about. Uh, I, uh, it's, uh, yeah, I, I think once NeoGAF collapsed, like, my primary network for, like, seeing what Sony fanboys were trying to tell people really, uh, completely collapsed with it. I, I have no idea what they're saying to people anymore. Um, and that's probably for the best, because, uh, I don't know, I don't, I don't want to, like, spend my life bitching about Sony fans on, on YouTube, you know? Um, okay, incendiary grenade. I couldn't have just gone up the stairs. Like, shit, I, I couldn't have run away. I couldn't have, like, got them from a distance. Like, they had sights. They weren't tough. Sights are not that hardcore. I can't believe I couldn't handle a bunch of dudes with sights. Like, what the fuck? All right. Rushing in, you can't like kill them all. Like we legit like killed all of them in the building, and yet somehow we still failed. I just okay. Okay. Look at this. Yeah, I only have like yeah, thirteen bullets left. Shoot. Why do they keep running away? I don't. I hate the fact they come in unlimited waves. Just, okay, yep. Oh, 50 bullets. Look at that. Yeah, that's the most that's the most TMP bullets I've had. Okay, I think that might actually Wait, I thought I got two. Two rounds of TMP bullets. I don't only have 50 yet, whatever. Uh now ah, well that's uh I thought I had a hundred. Alright. Okay. Yeah, we probably should save the TMP for the for the crossbow people. Oh, no, we, we can use the rifle for that. Uh, actually, we should probably reload it now, come to think of it. Uh, let's see. Yeah, we can probably get them from a distance. Let's just go back to the entrance. God damn it. Actually, where'd you go? Missed. <sighs> I'm getting chased down so hard.
technically just go back to the uh, the merchant, sell my rifle, get the upgraded rifle, and that comes with like full bullets. So I think I think I might actually try doing that. Um, let's see. So that might actually help. Wait. wait. And there's too many places for them to respawn. Like, they shouldn't be respawning at all, to be honest with you. Ah. Damn! They just beeline for me! Wait, wait. 13 year old Grifter Gaming Wannabe, lurking, lurking in your chat, has absolutely mentally destroyed you? Wait, who? Like, I don't... I don't feel mentally destroyed. Are you talking about retro? I don't... I don't... No. I don't... I don't fucking care what retro says. That fucker's trying to tell me that, like... What the fuck was he even saying last night? Last time he was on. Uh... Yeah, what the fuck was... I don't even remember what he was saying. It was, like, some bullshit about, like, me simping for girls and dying in Rampa. Which is nonsense. I was I was shitting on uh, no. I think I was like shitting on Tenko or something. Uh like I, I don't I don't remember what I was doing. Yeah, come to think of it, it's pretty late. I probably should if I'm gonna play Dog and Rampa, I really should be doing it soon. I don't think I'll be able to get to it tonight because I've I've been so, so busy playing other things. Um to be fair though, I really I really needed to play this more. This needed to get done. Yeah, let's go back. We, we do not have enough bullets. I want I want a rifle, so we are going back. We are selling the shitty rifle, and we're going to upgrade it with the automatic. And that should give us, like... Wait, where's the merchant? Is there a merchant back there? I think there is. No, there isn't. Like, where the fuck... There's no merchant. Where the fuck do I get a merchant? Uh... Yeah, we're going to have to go way back. Shit, I, I don't think I've ever done those. <laughs> ever. Yeah, I guess we can get some um, first aid sprays. We can... This is so fucking stupid. Yeah, we're gonna have to make this easier on myself. Yeah, we're upgrading everything. Oh yeah, that's right. By uh, upgrading the ammo capacity for weapons, you actually get... Uh, them full too, so we can upgrade everything. What the fuck? Yeah, it's weird when you backtrack sometimes, because, like, they throw enemies at you that you normally wouldn't see, so. And yeah, I guess this is an example of that. Yeah, I haven't updated. I haven't upgraded the the shotgun at all since I got it. So I think if I just upgrade everything, I might have a, a more, more of a shot. Yeah, I, I, uh, like, with my, with the, the current state of my channel, I would say, like, Valve fanboys are becoming the, uh, the ones that I'm, uh, have the most problems with. Because they're delusional. Like, with them coming in, like, my like chat, talking about the Steam Deck, like, who the fuck cares about the Steam Deck? Like, it's not really a thing, and yet, they, they think it's gonna take over? Like, no, it's not gonna happen. It's, uh, it's delusional. And they're, the worst thing is they're gonna like once the Steam Deck is actually out, they're just gonna forget they ever they ever hyped it up. To be honest with you, like it's not gonna be. Um... Can I just get the mind thrower instead? Maybe, maybe that would work. It's actually cheaper. Not only will you need cash, but you'll need guts to buy that weapon. You know what? I think I'm gonna go for it. I am gonna use the mine thrower to deal with the fucking water room. Yeah, fuck the rifle. Is that um, all? 
<laughs> Thank you. Is that all straight? Can I get the scope? <laughs> Thank you. Okay, this is the... I don't have a rifle. What you like, I legit do not have a rifle. I have decided to not have a rifle. That is the, the weirdest fucking thing I think I've ever decided to do in this is game. Is that all stranger? Uh, let's do... Should I upgrade the... What I should write, upgrade you? the riot. The shotgun first. Is that all... <laughs> yeah. Not enough cash, stranger. Not enough cash, God damn, yeah, I don't have enough treasure. Uh... What are you buying? Yeah, shit. Is that all? Okay. <laughs> Thank you. You don't have enough treasure to do anything. Uh, okay, look at this. Uh... Okay, hopefully... Hopefully having a new gun helps. Swapping out the rifle for the uh, the mine the mine thrower. Let's let's see if this works. I don't I don't think I've ever used the mine thrower in any uh, meaningful capacity. So uh, let's see if this works. Let's let's see if this is a uh, helps us cut through these uh, the monsters here. At the very least, I have like twenty handgun bullets now. So. I like the upgrades more expensive on professional because it feels like I, I I feel like I got most of the uh, most of the treasures and like was pretty conservative about like upgrading and stuff. I, I don't know exactly why I don't um, I don't have a lot of money. Let's see if this works. <laughs> okay. You fucks are gonna get iced. All of you are dead. You're all gonna die. I don't remember this guy with, like, the executioner's mask. I, I don't remember that design. I guess I've never paid attention, but... What criticism have I towards Steam? I, I've made lots of criticism for Steam, like specifically that it's not as good as Nintendo Switch. Like Switch has better games. Uh, it's a better service, and, and like people don't want to admit it. Uh, let's see here. Like, people are legit... Steam fans legit are telling people that, like, the Valve Steam Deck is going to be able to run, like, every Nintendo Switch game. And, like, it, it's just not going to happen. <laughs> she got kidnapped, but she still did her job the way down the Switch. Okay. All these bullets. Okay. Yeah, so I, I'm gonna save the mind thrower for uh, for certain situations. Oh, for, what? Come on! What? They can't stop kidnapping her. Oh shit! Hang on. The aiming just keeps getting. I'm sorry to say this, Harmon, but Edelgard did every wrong. Like what? Like lose? That's the only thing wrong she did. <laughs> like shit. Okay.
I don't know. Like, I think uh, I'm, I'm worried that Three Houses, uh, Three Hopes, is going to get. Um, it's going to do that really shitty thing that uh, Age of Calamity did with like the, uh, the Golden Root, like AU shit. Like, I hated that. I uh, I think that's one of the, the the really important thing, like one of the critical aspects of Three Houses is how dark it is and how like nothing you do. Like there is no golden golden root essentially. Like no matter what you do, like a lot of people are gonna die. And I, I really like that about the about the story. Like I don't know, I, I think I think three hopes. Like if it goes down that route, which it seems like it might, um, I I'm not gonna like that at all. I have a, I'm still undecided whether or not I'm gonna buy it. because uh, on one hand I do want to guard. Uh but like I don't like modern modern warriors games. I think they're shit. I really should have played, like, uh, Fire Emblem Warriors and I come to think of it. Maybe this weekend. I mean, I like Fire Emblem Warriors a lot. I put, like, 50 hours. It's, it's still one of my most played Switch games, actually. Look at how many of these fuckers I, I'm blowing away, and yet they will not stay dead. Look at this. I have no ammo. I have, like, four mines, and that's it. Yeah, so like I, uh, there were like two major Nint uh, Nintendo announcements at the direct I actually did not like. I was gonna make a video about this, but I, I, should tell, I, should, I might as well say this now. I didn't like Fire Emblem Warriors uh, for the aforementioned reasons, and I don't like Xenoblade Chronicles 3 because I don't like Xenoblade Chronicles. Um, so yeah, it, it kind of sucks. Yeah, I think it says a lot about the quality of Nintendo Directs, where they can have like the opening and closing uh, fail, like fail to impress me entirely, and still somehow like. Um, what the fuck was I supposed to do? Like, two parasites in the room? When I have no ammo? Shit! Okay, hang on. Let's, uh... Fuck you. And... Fuck you. It's like, that was like three shots, but you don't get a lot of mines, do you? Come to think of it. Uh, I think I'm going to use the mine thrower instead of the rifle. I think it's a lot better, actually. Yeah, I've never seriously used the mine thrower in my life, so. I think I might have like toyed around with it, but. Wait. And they keep spawning, so we're gonna have to like just like a break for it, and just try and uh... follow me. <laughs> Fuck. Uh, do they have any? Yep. Let's just heal like it's so. And yet, with this thing, and... Fuck! Oh, no. <sighs> How long have I been doing this? A couple of hours, right? Well, I've been streaming this for a couple of hours, but I... I yeah, half an hour at least. Shit, alright. Well, at least we got the, the crossbow guys. We can just fire them. Oops, I think I missed. Kill these guys. Oh, I missed that one. Shit. Now I keep missing. Shit. 
Oh, yeah, you're unsteady. Fuck. It's very uncommon that I let her get kidnapped. Oh. Okay. Okay. I think we might as well just fight them out here, honestly. Oh, there's no reason to... Shit. Why? I can't... I can't reload... There's too many of them. Mario Kart DLC? I, I'm very excited for it. Uh, I, I love Mario Kart 8, so I'm uh, very eagerly anticipating that. It's coming out sooner than people think, like March, right? Oh, fuck! How did he get me from that distance? Hang on, let's just get a game over. I don't care. How are we gonna impress- How are we gonna do this? I, I can't manage this. How about we just uh, shoot these guys first? Uh, because fuck them. How did this guy get so close to me? Alright. Wait, if you kill the red guy, does that mean the, uh... Does killing the red guy prevent them from calling reinforcements? Because I think that might be the, the common link here. Hang on. Hang on, let's kill him real quick. Let, let's experiment. Let's see here... Yeah, if I could just get them to stop calling reinforcements. Yeah, if you can beat this room, you can beat the game for sure, I, I feel. 
Uh, I just don't have any mines anymore. Okay, let's reload. Damn it! That, he went charging towards me! Alright. It's like he knew. Okay, hang on. shouldn't even try to kill them. I should probably just shoot their legs and just walk past them. Yeah, because if, if you kill the guys in the shields... Okay, I think that might be what we need to do, is just keep guys with shields from respawning, and then just have Ashley turn the crank. Wait, fuck. I'm getting sloppy. She's not even on the switch! Way to go, Ashley! Wait. You have one job! Follow me. Go. Yeah, we got everything. Um... Oh. Yeah, they just jump out of nowhere. I can't. No! I can't keep. I can't get by them. I can't kill them all. What's the deal? Okay. Okay, maybe I should just. Just try to kill them all again, because they stop respawning eventually, right? <laughs> okay. I think we're just gonna like stay in the room and just kill them. I think we have enough ammo to just keep constantly just milking. Bullets out of everything I need to win. I just gotta get to the same position I was in last time. Uh, that one time where I uh, got, the, got the crane to come down. So I just stayed in here. That did work. Um, but now that I have more bullets, I should be able to pull it off. Shit, hang on. Ashley, get back. Back! No, what are you doing? I said back, Ashley! Okay, it's a good thing that I didn't kill her. Shit. Okay. Okay. Um... Wait, did I, did I push the crank? I, I think the crank is out, right? Let's hang on, let's check. Wait. Yeah, it is, okay. So I just gotta... Just gotta chill and just uh, keep blasting motherfuckers as they come into the room. Okay. I don't know, maybe I can just keep Ashley here and just, I don't know. Just lure them out.
I don't know. It would split their forces at least. But would they attack her if she's by? No. Yeah, they have to. They have to go through the across the room to fight her. So maybe. Hang on. I don't hear anyone coming. All right. Okay, I'm gonna try turning the crank. She's hearing for help. She's not kidnapped. Okay, I think I might be able to handle this. All right. It feels like there's a lot less of them all of a sudden. Alright. Oh, there she goes. Okay. Damn it! Out of the way! though. Um, I just gotta keep at it, I think. Uh, let's see. Okay, mines. Fuck you, and fuck you. Yeah, I have to make, like, three, like, really precise shots, like, before these guys get to me? Like, it's ridiculous. Actually, I think we're gonna use this one first, so I can boost my HP. Okay. Oops, fuck, hit the gun. Look at how many there are. Okay. Idiot! Okay. Okay. Uh. Yeah, I knew, knew she was going to get kidnapped. Uh. If I was playing as Ashley, I'd just be able to run around, let Leon do the work, but unfortunately, uh...
Camacho. Why did I bring Ashley? I'm, I'm supposed to leave her there. Shit. Okay, hang on. I forgot to leave Ashley there. Okay. There's, yeah, there's so much shit going on. It's impossible to keep track. Okay, blast them. Okay. I need more mines, actually. Ugh. Fuck you. cycling through everything. Look at how, like, top tier my gameplay is, and yet somehow I still can't win. This room is broken. Alright, here we go. Okay, here we go. Fuck. Uh, fuck. Shit. I, I don't have anything. Uh, okay, fire it again. Start far when it gets close. Yep, got him. I think we got it. I think we got it. Okay, we just gotta deal with the guy with some scythes and we're good. Okay. Oh, I don't have shit. Okay, I don't have any bullets in my. Oh, I forgot to reload the. Okay. I have. Mines, but I just need... Okay, okay, we got it. I think we got it. Okay, hang on. Let's heal Ashley just to be safe. My hands are sweating, guys. Like, shit, that was brutal. That was, like, the hardest thing I've done in a while. Fuck. Is, uh, yeah, that, this might not work for my, uh, oof. yeah, without a sniper rifle, this might be a little bit rough. I mean, I think I can get them with a handgun, too, but, it's, oh, yeah, rifle ammo, but I don't have a fucking rifle. Uh, I mean, I, push comes to shove, I can just go back and get it, but. I have never done this without a rifle. And I just keep coming. I will be glad when we get to the next chapter. Holy crap. Probably, uh, can't do it. Shit. She's just gonna get kidnapped every single time. Wait, wait, where'd this fucker come from? 
He just came out of no... Huh? Holy crap, at least we don't have to do the first half again. Fuck. Okay, hang on. Do we have any healing items? No, no, no healing items. I mean, I guess we can just backtrack and get some if we have to. I don't, I don't think so. I don't think so. Reload my gun. What was I doing? Actually, I'm worried about myself primarily because they're just gonna kidnap her and I can just get her whenever. Okay. Actually, I can just use the mind thrower. Ah, might not be fast enough. Okay, she got that. Okay, we're halfway done. How did she get herself kidnapped? Okay. How'd she get herself grabbed? Oh, oh shit, I'm running out of bullets. Uh... Oh, look at them. They're, they're everywhere. Bitch. Got her. Uh, but now the problem is I don't have anything to replace that with. Fuck. Oh. Fuck! I am so preoccupied. I should not be juggling like 20 things at once. You know, like... And doing this without a rifle is probably not the best. I I forgot you needed it, to be honest with you. Uh, okay, I think I'm going to save the... Yeah, because as long as they're not too close to her, they're pretty slow in general, so I just... Yeah, you need the rifle for this chapter for sure, right? No, they have things coming in after that. I mean, you're supposed to have it, but... Let's see, that kills her or not. Yeah, of course it does. <laughs> she just no. goes flying. Oh, no, I killed her. Okay, that's not going to work. Uh, do you think you leave and come back to get a rifle? That we're gonna get. I don't know what I'm doing. Should I guess I shouldn't have sold, sold it? I guess? I don't wanna go back and do it again, though. You know, like. Ugh. I've always done it, like, left to right. Let's see if right to left is any easier. I mean, I would be able to do it if I didn't have to, like, defend myself, too. It's just, I mean, if I, if I just went up there with her, it wouldn't be a problem, you know? Let's 
see, he has to use that. Yeah, I keep dying. That's too far. That shotgun's no good for that. Where the fuck did that guy come from? Oh, maybe it's the angle. Maybe it's something. So can I use the shotgun? For this thing, this section designed for the rifle? The whole thing? It's really weird. Okay. Fuck, hang on. She keeps screaming, because the fuckers won't die. It's not practical to do. Okay, hang on. Maybe if I like fire it ahead, I can knock him down or some shit. Yeah, this isn't gonna work. No. Yeah, we're gonna have to go back to the rifle. That was really. This entire section was just like. What, what the fuck was I thinking? <laughs> like, what? Okay, so you need the rifle for sure. It's not even that hard. It's just, I don't have what you need. Uh, okay, so let's go. Two more hours of stream time. I don't, I don't know. Do you think I should play Dongan Romper real quick? I, I I think I might wait until tomorrow to play it, honestly. I kind of want to play other things. This is the first time I've uh, streamed Wii U in a while, so. Yeah, I might just get the rifle and then just save it. Yeah, this is a weird, weird situation. I've never had this problem before. I mean, to be fair, I've never sold the rifle for a good reason, because, like, that was. That is the dumbest. <laughs> that, that was a dumb thing to do. I, I knew it was a bad idea, but I was like, I, I need to get past the section. And of course, the section immediately after requires you to use a rifle. I, I completely forgot. I completely spaced it. I knew it was a bad idea, but no, well, whatever. First of all, let's get like a cave and pal. I'm buying the same thing I sold. What the fuck? Yeah, so I should never have sold it basically is what we're getting at. And look at this. We gotta let's see, we gotta get some first aid spray, because of course we do. I've never had to abuse the merchant in this way. I this is the first time ever in history that I've done this. This is ridiculous. Okay. I have, uh, yeah, five, I have five uh, rifle shots. Come back anytime. Okay, so... Yeah, I think I wasted a bunch of pesos by doing this. Unbelievable. Unbelievable. Like, I don't know what it is, but, like, every time... Now that I'm streaming regularly, like, I keep embarrassing myself by doing shit like this. I, I don't know. I guess it's because I'm playing a lot more games than I normally would. Um... Because I don't think I'd be playing a lot of this stuff if it wasn't, like, specifically to show it off. I think we will get past the water room, uh, just so it's, so it's all clear. What 
are the Wii U games that I have? Like Zelda, Twilight Princess, Wind Waker. Yeah, I think we're gonna do both. Hey, yeah, after Majora's Mask, probably. Yes, they haven't respawned. The thing is still down. Okay, this should be. This is actually pretty. This part's pretty straightforward. I just needed the rifle. All right, let's see how. Uh, let's see how we do. Now that we actually have everything we need, sure. Watch out for me. This should not have taken so long. Like, it really shouldn't have. Okay. Holy crap, it's so satisfying. What do you mean I can actually zoom in and, and fire for headshots? What do you mean it's not necessary for me to like just juggle like a bazillion different things? Okay. And I probably should have gone back and like got the rifle immediately. I mean, I thought it was worth a try, but uh, yeah, it's, it's impossible. Well, I, I don't think it's impossible. I just need a lot more hand guns. And, you know, after the water room, I just think it's okay. Like, it, it's possible to do. I'm sure it's possible to do. I just have, wasn't able to do it. To pull it off. Um... There we go. Perfect. Oh, fuck you, Bo. Oh, wait. They're everywhere. Wait, hang on. Where did these fuckers come from? Hang on. Yeah, the, the exit is a bit further than I thought it was. Again. Stop screaming, Ashley. Take care of yourself. Like, you didn't, shouldn't have to go right back to the crank, I think, but... Oh, that's the, that's my throw. That's the last thing I want. Yeah, the, the mind throw is such a double-edged sword. It's really useful in certain situations, but boy, have I had problems with it. How many of these fuckers I've had to blow apart? Holy like, shit. No, fuck! Kill all of them before she comes back. Kind of feels like it, to be honest. Oh fuck! This... They're everywhere. I hate this room with a passion. Like, there's nothing good about it. Like, it's just not fun. Like, uh... yeah, this series, this entire area is rough. Yeah, worst room in the game. <laughs> I hate this room. Finally! Holy crap! <sighs> holy crap, we beat it. Oh, fuck. I'm, I'm sweating. I'm so sore. Holy crap. That was awful. I'm not gonna fight them. We're just gonna jump. Aw, oh, she, she grunts when she jumps. Okay. Okay, let's go. I can't leave Ashley behind. I'm not leaving her behind. She's right there. Okay, we're good. Next area. What are these upside down statues? It's such a weird design choice, but. 
Alright, we need the chapter at least. Huh? And now we don't have to deal with Ashley for a while. Until like chapter 4, I think. My government issue crack pipe? I'm not like privileged enough to uh, to get one. What's the story behind that? Like I I don't know. I haven't been followed. I, I can't follow Biden's nonsense. I, I really can't. Um I mean you can't really criticize Biden anyway without people immediately like assuming you uh well knowing that you're <laughs> you're not a Democrat, so Should I play something else, or uh, do you want to keep me? I'd love to keep playing. I'm having a blast, but. Hunnigan, what happened? The transmission got cut off. <laughs> Salazar. Should I get through three, two? We've jacked the line. We didn't want you telling everyone any unnecessary information. Where's Ashley? Ah, oh, so she fell into one of our wonderful traps. We'll make sure we find her. Don't you worry I don't even know where she is. I don't understand. Like, throughout all of Chapter 3, 2, and 3, 3, like, um, Ashley's just there, and they don't recover her? How? Like, it doesn't make any sense. I look forward to our next encounter in another... I don't know, like, there, there are so many plot holes in this game, it's just... It, it, it's kind of amazing to point them out, but... Here we go. Go. I think we're gonna. It'll be nice. It'll be nice to just get to standard and just walk forward levels again. Now, back in the day, people were terrified of this sewer level. Like I remember seeing YouTube videos of like top five stick various areas in Resident Evil Four, and it was all shit like the sewer. Yeah, I I'd like to see that video again. Um, just just to see like retro YouTube content. It was like the sewer. There was like the hedge maze. I don't know, I don't feel... I never thought this game was particularly scary. Yeah, yeah, whatever. explain what these things are, but all the non-human creatures, it doesn't matter. Yeah, there's a lore bit uh, on these things. I don't think I've seen them. I, I, I tend to walk past like the notes in this a lot of the notes in this game these days. So maybe I, I'm just not up to date on like the lore. I, I probably should like just look at the, the notes one of these days. So I'm like caught up again. Um, Shit. Right up in my face. I don't know. I don't understand why some people might bug scary. I've, uh, I've never understood it. I mean, I'm... Uh, I'm not sure what my fears are these days. Oops, I didn't even see them. Uh, handgun ammo. Yeah, I'm just blowing through all my bullets. All right. He led, motherfucker. Green eye, velvet blue. Well, at least we're getting treasures. Is there anything down here that I can use?
I really gotta pay more attention to the treasure. I'm walking past everything. I guess I guess I'm kind of rusty when it comes to picking that thing, that stuff up because there's a lot of stuff I haven't done. can't throw them off before they get one attack in. It's just... Eh. God damn it, got me. Fuck. Eh. Yeah, I think I'm ready for a break. What am I going to play next? Uh, yeah, the water room burned me out. This, this area is not that difficult at all, but I, uh, I just feel I just feel kind of exhausted all of a sudden. Uh, let's let's take a break from saving Ashley and, and do something else. She can stay kidnapped. Um, yeah, what else do I have over here? Let's see. Yeah, a little King story we were streaming at one point. Uh, I, I don't think I want to play that right now. Let's wait a while longer for that. Uh, River City Girls, Metro Prime 3, uh, yeah, let's wait on all that. Wonderful what I want. Let's wait until we beat Bayonetta for that. Zelda, until Metro's Mask. Um, let's see, Mario Maker. Uh, should we switch back to Switch? Yeah, it looks like a lot, a lot of the stuff I want to stream is like N64 and Wii stuff. I don't want to set that up tonight. Uh, uh I think we're going to switch back to Switch and, uh, see if Majora's Mask went live. I doubt it, but... Oh, I guess we could check the, uh... The digital games on Wii U real quick and see what I have. Um, I actually bought Star Fox Command. Uh, we'll probably play it after 64. Oh, really? That's that's good. That's nice. Yeah, I, I need to play more Legends of Ooh, I was gonna play it tonight. I, I, com I completely keep forgetting I own Legends Arceus. Every time I stream, I'm just like, oh man, I gotta get through Resident Evil 4, I gotta get through, like, uh, Dagon Rampa, I gotta get through this and this. I keep forgetting Legends Arceus is a thing. I just, I don't know what it is. And I like the game a lot, too, so. Mm. Yeah, yeah, Legends Arceus, I think. I, I really think it, it's gonna go down as one of the all-time great Pokemon games. Like, people have been bitching about a lack of innovation for years, and um, Ar Legends Arceus seems to have delivered on it in spades. Okay, so, let's see. DuckTales, Castlevania, Wario Land 4. Yeah, I have to play through a lot of those. Super Castlevania 4. Uh, how about Castlevania Advance or something like that? Rayman, Raving Rabbids, Ogre Battle 64. I gotta play that. Fatal Frame, uh, Mass Attack, Candorous Curse, Freedom Planet, Trauma Team, I want to move your targets, uh, tactics, tadpole trouble, boss reavers. Yeah, a lot of this stuff is going to be coming to to Wii U uh, to Switch soon. So DK sixty four, playing a swing. Super Mario Bros. Three. R type Watchdogs, Harvest Moon. I gotta get back and play Harvest Moon sixty four one of these days. I really gotta finish it. Uh, Legend of the Mystical Ninja, Minish Cap. Yeah, that, that can wait for a while. Yeah, there are games I want to play on here, but okay. We we are uh, switching to Switch again. Back to the uh, Nintendo's modern console. Let's see here. Okay. I'm trying to decide what I want to play. Not Banjo-Kazooie, not Ocarina of Time. Uh, Star Fox, maybe? Origami, Bayonetta? I don't know, maybe I should just do Danganronpa. Because there's not really a whole lot... You know, yeah, let's do Danganronpa. We, we need to get through Danganronpa. I have time. 
about three hours, so well, two hours. Yeah, it's uh, let's get the dog and wrap up. Hey, it's been a while. Yeah, right when you get start getting into Don Game, it'll be time to go. Well, that happens every stream, though, with this series, right? Because I'm always, like, interested in something, and I, I kept playing them until the very end, so... Yeah, it's nothing new for me. <laughs> yeah, it's really obnoxious. I, I wish I had, like, the free time to just, uh... I really wish I had played through all of it, like, the month it came out. I mean... I got, I've gotten through them pretty quickly, compared to, like, uh, Famicom Detective Club. How long did it take me to go back to the Famicom Detective Club and finish that? You know, like, a couple of months? Like, I, I got through the, this pretty quickly. To be fair, though, I I really like this a lot. Uh, let's see. Where were we? What were we even doing? I don't remember. Kato's an idiot. All right. Interesting. My intuition is as the ultimate ultimate detective. Okay. Yeah, Kibo, probably. Kibo was talking about using an air tube to swim. Because he can't swim normally. Mascots, I, I um, uh, I really think this needs to be said. Like uh, the mana, like none of the mascot characters really added anything to the series. They don't need to exist. Like they don't need to be as prevalent. Just be, you know, just legit. Just describe the situation. Uh, be the judge, and that's it. Like you don't need to give exposition. Like it, it's all, all of that is just pure shit. Like I'd rather not be there. I can't imagine that. I don't know. Japanese people eat their shit up, so. It was obviously Kibo, though, right? Because he was talking about using one. Like, uh, I don't know. It just feels like... At the very least, no one alive. Okay. Hey, so. 
Yeah, fuck them. And then kill himself, yeah. Fuck it. Okay. I'm so hungry, but I really don't want to eat before my dentist appointment. Uh, I mean, it's not that much longer, but... Uh, let's see. I mean, the fuckers call contacted me and scheduled it, like, an hour later. Because I wanted it, like, um, like an hour and a half from now. But like, now it's, like, two and a half hours. I don't want to stay up that late. Fuck. Fuck that. Uh, but, yeah. Ah, I hope this isn't... Have you seen everything? Now, what else do I need to investigate? <laughs> yeah. What are my objectives? Uh, I guess we can look at the map and see. Port card map. Okay. Why can't I just warp over there? That drives me nuts. I hate walking everywhere. Okay, I just want to go right. Where... I'm an Ace Attorney fan, right? Like, I don't need a whole lot of like. An open world environment. Just give me the fucking okay. Door, door. Wait, whose room? Which one is his room? Here it is. I can barely make out the images. They're so small. No, maybe the video the videos might not have been returned. Where are we going? Alright, what, what do we need to get now? Let's see... Library... There we go. Yeah, I'm really anxious to get back in the eighth, Great Ace Attorney, honestly. Uh, that's, that's what I've been thinking about a lot, is like... Uh, everyone keeps telling me that two is better than one, so... I,
She keeps enough with calling yourself plain. Shit, I'm not gonna compliment you, you bitch. Okay. Spotted eye. Ha 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 something? Ah. You played tag. Kurumi. Like shit, she she's the one who I think is super suspect this uh this case. Like uh she was the one I uh, I nominated as the culprit. Um so that that's my uh that's my guess, Kurumi. <sighs> Half decade girl. Wait, what? seems so likely I am 100% convinced she's a red she's a red herring I I refuse to believe that Angie would have done it no <laughs> there is no way I am positively 100% sure no like she has to be this game is Toko right where she just says all the super suspect things and then never actually does anything she might get murdered but I I don't see her being a killer just like I don't see Fukichi being a killer here we go How exactly? <sighs> we get everything we need, or monitor maybe? Yeah, it doesn't have any surveillance equipment. I, I don't understand what the deal with that is. Like, why is there no surveillance equipment? The first two games had them everywhere. It, it's one of those weird things. Uh, saw. <sighs> oh, large water tank. Okay. So where the piranhas were. Okay. Ah, 
hang on. Okay, hang on. What was the trick? I had through the top that opens the water escape tank. Okay. But wait a minute, but why does Himoko believe she actually knows how to use magic? I, I don't... She's so insistent about that. Like, I legit thought... That, like, it comes off like she legit thinks that she has magic powers. Like, is she just that dedicated to bitter? What, what is she doing? Uh, I don't know. There's, like, so many weird character kid bits like that that don't really make a whole lot of sense. Like, is Byakufu a red pill? Or... <laughs> Does he know? Uh, here we go. Um, uh, and, like, who Sonya never mind lost her virginity to. Like, I don't know. We're, we're never going to get an answer. Like, it's just not, it's just not going to happen. Amiko is a strange one. Oh, yeah, for sure. I don't know, I, I kind of like that, though. I just, I just... Uh. Uh. I mean, I think Angie's like... I don't, I don't know, like, everyone in Dagonapa seems like dysfunctional as fuck. You have, like, Tenko and her insanity. You have, like, uh, her rabid feminism. You have Hamiko literally believing she has magic powers. You have Atua, uh, Angie... Like, uh, sacrificing virgins to Atua or, or whatever. Like, it's just... Everyone is, like, fucking insane. All right. <gasps> Who is the ultimate tennis pro? Like, this, this building is too complex. I think it's upstairs, actually. So tired. I... Okay. Okay. Tennis pro lab. of evidence. That's different. Oh, the tennis net. It's not... Oh, hang on. Hang on, but... I can't look at it. What's the... Hey, are you not supposed to notice that? Hang on. I noticed that! I know what tennis nets are supposed to look like. Okay. Is he a victim of rape? Hey. 
Could those be handcuff marks? Like they wrapped it up, the chain around it? What are the gamer snacks? Um, caramel popcorn. Luminary of the stars. Okay, whatever. I noticed this immediately. Am I like a better detective than Suichi? Because I keep picking up on like stuff like this that he's obviously just ignores. That would have been the first thing I would have noticed. Where is Hamaki just staying outside her room? What's the deal with that? <laughs> no! She's hardcore! Best girl.
Yeah, I wonder if that's going to be relevant in any way. Yep. Yep, yep. Oh no, it's getting meta on. It's I hate I hate you, Monokuma. <laughs> All right, here we go. I'm going to survive. We're going to survive together. I can't die in a place like this. Never. To be curry with me. I am. Oh, here we go. This guy's every. How, how is he beating me down here? Yeah, there's been too much focus on Kurumi in this chapter. There's no way she didn't do it. Um, like, did someone just tell her to do it, like, offhand? Like, just kill fucking Ryoma for me because he sucks? Uh. Yeah, the victim was more surprising than anything else. Uh, yeah, I was not expecting Ryoma to die. I, I like the character too much. Ah, uh, well. I mean, that's what makes the game good. Like, you really have no idea what to expect. Armin versus Yashiro? Okay. Yeah, there are just a lot of characters I just hate in this series, for sure. anymore, is it? Uh, let's see. Let's see what Kurumi has to say about this. Uh, yeah, she looks nervous. She knows I'm on to her.
Her gender? What the fuck does that even mean? Like, <laughs> what? You, you're awful. She has to know something. I made a promise to Kaede, yeah, for sure. You're all gonna run if you're alive. Hey! Atsu <laughs> Owl. Yeah, come on, so, uh... Oh no! How'd you know? <laughs> Is he really trying to bang Hamiko? Ah, uh, <laughs> was he serious? <laughs> she's gotta be a she's gotta be a red herring, right? Yeah, she knows. Don't tell me that's the twist. Is that Hamiko did fucking kill him? Oh man, it's Shadakuma. I miss Kaede so much. I, I haven't talked enough about that, but I fucking loved her. And she's dead. No. Ah. Okay. She was so nice. She was best girl. Like, yeah, I don't... She looks so happy. Uh. Let's go ahead and save it. Great. I really, I've been tired. I want to go to bed, but I'm going to have to stay up so I can go. And uh, I'm so angry about that. Why, why did they change the time? I'm I, mean, I could have said no, but ugh. Yeah. I probably should have. Yeah, I've told them. Ugh. Yeah, yeah, yeah. <laughs> Yeah, 
Yeah, that rule didn't exist in the first two games. I wonder what changed. Combine our power. <laughs> She's just gonna defend her. <laughs> Dude, your your waifu doesn't like you. Fuck off. <laughs> he even sounds annoyed. Ah <laughs> oh, no. She's backstabbing her? What a bitch! What a bitch! This bitch needs to shut the <laughs> needs to stop. I am the ultimate detective. Well, Kyoko didn't do a whole lot of shit, like, oh, whatever. Wait, what? <laughs> what? 
Yeah, before the shot. Yep, yep. Oh no! Oh no! Oh, that explains everything. Oh, daddy issues. Yeah, yeah, someone played Ace of 34. I agree with Maki, best girl. Okay. Oh no, she's defending her waifu. Shit, like... by this bitch. like the square
got it. Yep, yep. Yep, yep, yep. I don't, I don't know. This trick isn't particularly impressive. She really is. She's the ultimate magician. Like, I think fucking Trucy Wright did, like, more crazy shit. Like, uh, I'll have to play Ace Attorney 4 again, but. I don't know. She had, she had a lot more resources, though. I fucking hate you, Mew. I fucking hate you! You... Oh, wait a minute. She changed her uniform. So she was the half naked girl. Okay. But wait a minute. What did what did Kikochi see her? Wait a minute. That was that. They didn't rehearse though, right? Hang on, that doesn't make any sense. Hang on. Let's see, Gamata's accounts. Okay. Well that would have been Hibiko, but. She didn't have time to rehearse. Why was she doing that? The dormitory is stopped with many impulses. I have never seen Kimiko go to the gym this morning. Carrying a uniform and a towel. Oh no! Why would you say that? I see. She had a towel too. Wait, what? <laughs> what does that even mean? Wait, so she. So she just. She just insists that it's real magic? Why? Well, I mean, they're both pretty small. Yeah. 
And she really wants to fuck over. Even though. Ah, oh, no. <laughs> oh, no! She's low key admitting it. Oh, no. Yeah, yeah, whatever, Tenko. You're never, never going to smash. You will never be a man. Oh, right, here we go. Okay. Hang on. Well, no. Like, if it didn't happen right away... Yeah, 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 Kira, whatever. Ah, fuck, I missed. I had it. I, that was exactly what I needed. Ah, whatever. Yeah, why is no one bringing this up? Okay. Like, this isn't... I don't know, this entire thing just didn't feel... I don't know, this entire line of questioning didn't feel necessary. Yeah, this is giving me, like, major case three of Tagen Rava 1 vibes, where I figured it out, like, immediately. Okay, here we go. Yeah, I, I, I have had no surprises so far. I, th I think I figured it out immediately. Like, did, did I did I mention that that like uh, Ryoma was in the tank, uh, the Piranha tank? Here we go. Oof. Yep, yep. I hate you, Mew. Okay. <laughs> Fucking Mew. Yeah, hopefully, hopefully Mew, Mew dies. I, I, I not not a fan of hers. She's annoying. Like shit. I, I don't know why people didn't. I, I don't know why we're even talking about this because it seems she's pretty straightforward. All right.
Ah, uh, I see. The square glass pane. Okay, that was what that was. Okay. Okay, I see. I, I kind of assumed that, like, the piranhas wouldn't be able to eat him at that... I don't know. Okay. Got him. Yeah, yeah. Yeah, 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 okay. No, no, hang on, that's wrong. <laughs> that was wrong. Uh... What's the question? What exactly was obscuring the body from view? Pool rules. Okay, whatever. Hang on. Uh... There we go. It was like, it's something to do with the thing. Okay. Yep, yep. Yep, yep. What a bitch! Ah, 
what a bitch. Oh, no! What an absolute chat. <laughs> Shit! <laughs> oh no. And it was Karumi. typically how it works. Okay. The bitch slip. Oh, that's hilarious. <laughs> Why is she spazzing out? Does she like being called a bitch? Uh, whatever. Oh, 
Uh, uh, oh, wow. So we're, okay, we're going, okay, let's go in that direction. Why is no one questioning Angie, though? I can't believe we didn't at least question Angie. Because, like, Angie was the one acting suspicious as fuck. Don't tell me it's going to be a twist ending with, like, oh, man, Angie did it. Like, fuck. I mean, I would prefer Angie to die over Karimi, but... Uh, I mean, I like Karumi. I, I don't like Angie at all. She's a bitch! Yeah, Maki was alone. Whoa. 
was uh, Gata's account? Hang on, that's right. Got him. Okay. That Sakurumi is full of shit. That bitch. Come on. It seems far more plausible that you were telling another lie. Unlike robots, we need that can't pull out our memories from our hard drive. That's supposed to infinity, or rationality feels a bit fitting. If I'm an act, that means I can put the knowledge in five minutes, transport it into the gym, and hit it into the gym. Yeah, yeah, whatever. I know you dick. She was scaring off Gonta. Oh. She's 
She used your titties. All right. Oh no! This fucker! Okay. Shit! Oh no! What a thought! What a thought! Yeah, most of it, sure. that you has an actual alibi. Yeah, it took a while, but we should remember all of this in case we need to recall these events again. That leaves Kaito and Maki. I we should get going, huh? Belongs to. 
Can you guess everyone? Who? That's it. We have to be Bakis. This is even more difficult to comprehend than Kokichi's antics. You're totally not serious. You can't be that stupid, right? No, he might actually be that stupid. to believe in someone is a beautiful act, yes. However, it is a sentiment that has no place in a class trial. Even idiot, after all. It's okay to be idiot, as long as you believe in people. Guys, I said don't call me an idiot. It really hurts my feelings. I mean, he's an astronaut. How exactly is he this dumb? I don't understand. Like, it made sense for Yasuhiro to be dumb, but, like... I don't know. Dagen has like the, some of the stupidest characters I think I've seen in anything ever. It's really weird. Oh, she's a sudden dear, eh? Oh.
but I can't stay silent forever. So I'll tell you. Oh, tell us what? I met up with Ryoma during night time yesterday. What? What? Yeah, I think now is probably a good time to take a break. I can't believe I've, um, I'm still not done. I really, these trials take a lot longer than I, I keep estimating. I don't. Yeah, eight hours? Wait, no, 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 that's the time. Okay. Yeah. <laughs> I was just like, oh, wait, okay. Yeah, so I think we're going to end the stream now. Uh, and I'll probably come back tonight and play some more. Uh, I really should have finished. I really got to I really got to dedicate some time to get this uh to get this game finished. Um so yeah, probably probably tomorrow at 1 I'll uh, come back on and try to get uh, class, trial 2 will be done and uh, hopefully we'll get the trial 3 done uh, before the end of the day, before the end of the weekend. So yeah, thank you all for tuning into the Black Cat show. Be sure to check out my books at